Yo, what's up everybody and welcome to today's video, which is going to be Unranked to Masters, who educational on Kale. I've taken a look at some of your comments from the recent videos and I have made sure that there are some losses in this you know, video as well. So you guys can learn from those scenarios, what I do in losses and how I try to basically play around the fact that I'm losing the game. And you guys can see where I still make mistakes that lead to me losing the games, right? So I try to find a balance between losses and wins so that you guys can all learn from it. Now, if you like this type of content, I would really appreciate it if you guys can leave a like and a subscription as it helps me out a lot. Super close to 100k. And and I'd really appreciate to get there. Enjoy the video, guys. See you there. Every move you made, I was watching you. If you are serious about improving and climbing to your desired league rank, you're in the right place. This year, I've worked on laying out two courses that will help you in all aspects to improve. One is about all the fundamentals for the landing phase, and the other one goes in-depth on tempo and the mid to late. I've been challenger for 7 years and I can guarantee you that this will massively speed up your process and reaching any goal that you have set in mind. Both courses have a preview video where you can see the style of the videos, so check those out before anything. You can also always join my Discord to check out some reviews. Alright, let's get into the video. Alright guys, doing our first little kill game here. Now, uh, I'll talk about the runes when I see my matchup. I'm playing TP 100% of my games with kill. I tried some ghost lethal tempo setups, but I just think TP is the most important summoner on kill. I'm never playing without it. Uh, so I just go flash TP every game. I think TP as a summoner is too important. I'm gonna, I'm gonna not ban anything. Um, so the, my go-to ban throughout the playthrough is going to be Aurelia, especially after I play against Aurelia twice in one day, which both bots will be in the, in the video as well. But ultimately, uh, I'm playing these games at the end of the challenge, so I, I've already hit Masters on kill, and I'm going to walk you through all my thoughts here in this, uh, you know, the starting uh, MMR games. So let's see what matchup we face. We're going to have an AP jungler and an AP mid, which is already interesting, right? So here I'm already considering I'm going to go more for the AD build instead of AP, because of AP mid, AP top uh, jungler and AP top, it's not that good. So uh, I'm always going to go for AD kill options here, simply because I don't want to be triple AP top side. It's just not good. There are three types of build that you can go on kill. You've got the crit build, which is basically full AD with Infinity Edge Mythic. You've got the on hit build with Rage Blade Mythic, and you've got the AP build with Rift Maker uh, Mythic. Those are the three builds that I've used throughout the playthrough. Uh, I only use two different starting items. I go Kraken Slayer starting item or Blade Rune King uh, starting item. I go Blade Rune King against Hell Stacking Champions. So like Shen, Tom Kenj, maybe Volley Bear champions that are stacking a lot of health, right? So I go Blade Rune King against anything else, anything else. I'm going Kraken Slayer start. So here against Set, this is actually an extremely good matchup for me. It is only annoying in the early game because of how strong set is in the early game. But after the early game, it's going to be amazing. I'm so confident in this matchup that I'm even going to run lethal tempo. And I'll show you guys why. Now, I think on kill, you run either fleet, lethal tempo. Some players also run PTA, but I haven't really found the windows where I'd be looking for PTA. Uh, this is 100% going to be a Kraken Slayer type of game, unless he builds hard steel, then I will go Blade Run King. So when I'm looking at enemy comp, uh, I would say I'm in a pretty good position. The only thing I'd really need to be careful for is like Vega, Cage, and Lux Q. Uh, or maybe getting set ulted, right? But those, you know, I should be able to avoid them. I'm playing Unflinching Bone Plating. I go Bone Plating because set is extremely strong in the early game. I need to get through the early game. And uh, with Lethal Tempo, I could arguably also win against set in the early game. Which is something that a lot of players don't respect. Because Kale with Lethal Tempo and her passive is actually one of the strongest level 1 champions. Only level 1 though, level 2 you fall off, but level 1 you are a monster. Set is going to be stronger than me and I'm just going to scale to level 6. So, let's go up here, I'm going to go start a D-Blade, you go D-Blade, D-Shoot, I don't take D-Ring, again we're playing AD. And uh, to re-emphasize this, I always go Kraken Slayer or Blade Rune King Rush. If this guy is going to rush Heart Steel, I will go Blade Rune King. If this guy is rushing any other item like a normal Mythic, I'm going to go for my Kraken. Now, the rest of my build, so they have AP damage here, AP damage here. Witsend is a pretty good option, so I'm thinking here Kraken, maybe Blade, right? Else Blade Rune, uh, like Blade Rune King or Witsend, Infinity Edge, because I don't want to build too much HP, right? The AP, they have AP here, AP here, AP here, and even Kai'Sa can deal some uh, magic damage, right? Depending on her build. So I definitely want to go full AD here. So, um, yeah, there's that. <clears throat> okay, let's look for a ward in the early game if we can. Set is defending it, so I won't be able to. I can already select E, and I'm going to try and force him away. And by doing so, I get my ward down. And now I know how both jungles are going to be pathing in the early game. Because if I know where Amumu starts by looking at tap, and if I know where Kane starts by having this ward. Because ultimately, if Kane doesn't start blue buff, I know he's starting bot side, right? Or, or I guess my jungle. But if he starts blue buff, I know exactly what he's going to do. So that's the reason why I placed this ward down. 
All right, Seth is gonna face check me. I'm gonna see if he has bone plating because I want to remove his bone plating. I'm gonna hug the wall so he sees me later. Maybe. No, he saw me. Oh, come on. No bone plating. Good. We have that information. Okay, and now I'm going to hit the wife here, level one, to stack up my passive. You got five passive stacks, right? You get more movement speed, you get more attack speed, so I want to try and get my five passive stacks to actually, actually look for priority here. Set is not walking with the wave, so that allows me to look for priority here, and I will gladly take that. So now I already have five passive stacks, even before he's reaching the wave. And I'll try to stack lethal tempo when I can as well. Drop the me and aggro though, because my E does draw me and aggro, because it's an auto attack, right? If he fights me, he loses. I'm not sure if he knows. He loses this. He can't win. Look at this. GG. Told you. All prepared. He had no bone plating. I have my bone plating. I have my passive stacks. Uh, Kane is passing into top. So I need to look for a crash here. But I think I'm going to look for a third wave crash. Maybe I should have done a second wave crash. I think I'm just a little bit too late though. Ultimately, right now, what I have to do is look for a crash, right? If I get this wave to crash comfortably in a way where I'm not going to lose too much, then I'm happy. If I get all three melees here and the cannon, I, I, I can leave with a with a good conscience. I don't need the casters per se. Oh. He still has flash, but I got to keep in mind. He has no potions, though. I'm going to just get the cannon and dip. He's also level three now. I'm going to stand in range. Get the cannon and there you go. Okay. Um, I think here I just buy boots, dagger, refillable. Refillable is super strong. This wave is going to start slowly bouncing back into me, even though it doesn't look like it. Kane is coming into top, but I'm almost top side as well. So I want to contest this bounce, so I need to buy a pink ward, because I need to see if Kane is coming or not, right? Uh, usually I don't buy pink wards, but in this one scenario I will, and that is because I have the item lead here and the sustain lead, and both are going to top side. I want to be allowed to play aggressive here. But if I want to do so, I'd also need some wards, right? So here I buy a pink ward just so that I'm allowed to play a little bit more aggressive here. I'm going to play for my level 4. I lost one melee minion of EXP. So I'm going to need to try get one melee from this 5th uh, wave in order to get my level 4. So he's already level 4. But now after I get the melee and one caster, I'll be level 4 as well. And we max Q. I usually put 3 or 4 points in Q and then start maxing my E. Okay. In max e oh, I saw Kane here. 24 CS. I move my 28 CS. So there you can either both go for both sides scuttle or Kane could look to gank top, right? I saw the Kane very briefly. Or you can just recall go both sides, but if set walks up like this, I have a feel yeah, hey! Jungle tracking! Jungle tracking chat! Always think about the junglers before you do anything, right? I saw Kane there. 24 CS. There's no more camps to clear, right? He has either going he's either going to look to gank top. Or reset and go bold. That's why I'm careful on that one timer. That's the one timer I have to be respectful of. I'm respectful. Now we're chilling. Now the set can play. All right, go for the cannon, buddy. I know you want it. I know you want this cannon. Try right, look for it. Come. Yeah, die for it. Oh, he hit level five though. I sidestep that with luck. Okay, my bad. He had level five there, so I had to be a little bit careful. Now I'm level five too. So now I want to bait him again to walk up for a last hit. I'm gonna stand backwards, bait him to go for a last hit, and now kill him. Okay, go for last hit, buddy. You know you want to. Keep him on my passive attacks. Oh, you gonna go for that one? All right. I have to dodge this W. If I get my Q. Oh, you are a lucky fellow. Cheeky little fellow. It's okay. Let's crash this. Why do I start becoming Cho'Gath? Okay. You gonna walk up or what? If I just crash this, he's stuck in lane, by the way. So it's okay. I don't need to kill him here. I really don't have to. If he walks up for last hit. Oh. Yeah. QE comes out instantly. Oh, yo, yo, yo. He had to instant W. Goodbye. Give over. Right. So the thing is, this matchup is actually playable for set pre-6. And it's going to be extremely unplayable for him right now. I'll show you guys, okay? Right now, with lethal tempo and with range advantage, there's genuinely... And I'm, I'm not kidding genuinely nothing he can do anymore because i have tier two boots so he can never walk up to me i have the range advantage i'm just gonna do this, 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 this. yeah you get the point i got some black coffee too GG. Ah, you see how i'm almost upset again somebody just hit this word that is probably the cane oh no it was set okay GG. he has no potions it's the first time i know it's here too but i'm almost already top side i'm assuming here that cane is top side again as well right because both genres have bought into top twice so i gotta be somewhat careful of the cane but I flash in one minute. I have ult. Oh, Kane is mid and he's low HP. Look at this. How can he play? Dish, dish, dish. Uh, dish. 
Is it, are you okay? Okay, I won't I won't kill him, right? He's AFK, I think. He's just gonna fair fight. Hello? Wake up, buddy! Okay, I think he's back from his break. A little quick winter sleep. Are you okay? Settles? Oh yeah, I think he's fine again. <laughs> Alright, let's see if he enjoys the matchup now. I mean, can you play the game? Is he typing to his jungler or something? Is he DMing your mom? Chat, is he DMing your mom? I don't know here. Okay, I have had enough mercy for him. He better play the game now. Okay, he is playing. But you see, there's basically nothing he can do anymore. He has tier 1 boots, but he cannot get closer to me. Look at this. So every time he goes for last hit, I'm gonna give him gentle taps on the forehead. Because I'm that, that, that kind top laner. Look at this. Go for last hit, buddy. You don't even have to. You don't even have to. Alright. I'm gonna basically be allowed to push in permanently. Look for plates. Then I MCS. If he goes for last hit, boom. Give him like that. Auto. Oh, Kane is here. They can't do shit. I just gotta kite first. Wait for my Q as well. And... He has ult too. Just gotta play it slow. AKA, what's the counterplay? <laughs> Lethal tempo kill with six stacks. Yeah, buddy! There's a lot you can do! I still had flesh and ult, by the way. I'm telling you, chat, if you get through your early game on this champion, by the way, she is honestly broker. I think the champion is probably unplayable in like challenger elo, but like below challenger, master, grandmaster, I think the champion is really playable. In fact, I think she's also like what I what I noticed throughout my climb. This is one of the fastest climbs I've done, by the way. I did not expect it. I was like, how am I going to be able to play a ranged champion? I'm fundamentals abuser, but you see, all the fundamental concepts that we that we usually apply are still applicable to kill, right? Okay. How? Uh oh, I don't have mana. Now I've got mana. I need vision. Oh. Okay, I spaced really poorly there. That was mechanics, I guess. Ooh, got me a little sweating. Ooh, I think he wants me, chat. I think he wants me. Ah, come on! Okay! <laughs> okay, Kane could, Kane could come, so I gotta be fast here. Yeah, I also got the blade, by the way. And now he max E. Look at this. Oh, wait, I don't have Kraken yet, that's why. Okay, and now with Q, Kraken, auto attack, I basically one-shot everything. We're gonna go for Kraken, like I said. Noon Quiver is one of the nicest spikes you can have on kill. And right now, all I realistically have to do, chat, is expand my lead without taking risks. In the sense that I'm gonna go blue trinket. I will refresh my pink. All I need to do right now is not die, and then enemy team can never get back up. It's at least at top side, in terms of my strengths. It looks like my bot side is losing. My mid lane is kind of even, right? But I'm very far ahead in top side. So all I have to do is never die. And if I never die, this set can never catch back up to me in terms of equal resources, right? I'm like 2k gold ahead right now. I will continuously be 2k gold ahead as long as i don't die if only if i die can he get back in terms of my strength right now i don't have flesh and old so i gotta keep that in mind here so I, what i want to do is put the set a little bit lower hp so that even if kane comes i'm not that scared of a gang does that make sense so i'm gonna ward here too so now i have a pink ward i have a blue ward maybe i should have placed it here because it's always gonna go through the wall but i want to put the set on relatively low hp and i want to put that as my priority so that even if the cane were to come right now i don't have to be that scared Okay. <laughs> Gentle tapping his face every time. I think he's enjoying it. What do you think? <whistles> and Dur boss. Alright, now he's got a recall. He got no TP. Alright, what are you gonna do? Not much. Not much counterplay. To kill. Okay, Kane is top side. He is level 7. Uh, he's got tier and Dirk. Always check those items, but my Momu is way stronger. Right? Level 8, he's got a lot more items. So again, all I want to do is expand my lead. Play for plates. Uh, play for CS. I'm going to recall soon because I have Kraken. And remember, I'm going to go for the AD build this game, right? Because we got full AP champions. Alright, that's also one of the biggest benefits I found about kill. Is that regardless of uh, the comp, 
you are always able to itemize because you know you can just go for both sides you can go ad or you can go ap i think here i'll continue oh, i'll continue to go for wits end probably so i'm gonna go kraken wits end infinity edge and then bloodthirster serology something like this this is the build that kill 1v9 also recommended me it is extremely strong my wits end will allow me to play against this guy and this guy and then i just don't see how anybody can kill me in this game um also keep in mind we're already 10 cents or like almost 10 cents per minute right so now i just need to expand my lead without dying so i want to play for this turret i want to play for this herald i want to maybe get other turrets with that herald look for level 11 keep farming also kill is one of the best champions to expand your lead once you are ahead in the sense that you have extremely fast wave clear at level 11 before level 11 you see my wave clear is still kind of limited but look if i just do q auto 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 it's still relatively fast right but once i have um i'm gonna ask can i pick it up please for turrets i let you last it always try and make this deal with your junglers let me please right because if i can pick up the herald here i can maybe even look for a tier 2 turret I'm gonna last it because i'm a piggy all right please I did both double dipping. Thank you, bro. You're the GOAT. Just, you're the G. Just say that, all right? And now we get level 11. So when you get level 11, boom, my E, AOEs, right? So EQ, boom, one shot's a wave. Also with jungle camps. And now with five stacks, look, my auto attacks are like AOE. So now I'm going to play for this, get this tier one turret, right? Then after the tier one turret, I want to look for the tier two turret because they give 700 gold now. And all I'm going to do is expand my lead. I'm not going to look for kills. I'm not going to roam for kills. I'm just going to make myself stronger with resources on the map by playing correct tempo and correct macro here, right? I think it's fine to already herald to just speed up my gameplay. This is also why I asked to pick it. Oh, I looked into third range. This is not good. Or maybe I went a little too fast. But look at that AoE damage on him too. I didn't even land anything on him. Okay. Now I can get the third. I'm going to walk away. Uh, bait him to walk out. Oh, he can ult me. <laughs> yeah, keep leaving you little bitch! <laughs> wait till I have my wits end. Wait till I have my wits end, you little piggy. You just wait. He got my walk and shot on though. That's not good. But we got the tier 2 turret. So we've got. Oh, get that guy. Nice. We've got a lot of gold here still, nonetheless, right? And now my job is to expand my lead elsewhere. I see a lot of camps here, right? This wave is kind of stuck here, but it's okay. So Cinder's here. The chef TP, she does not. So I'm probably going to TP mid here. Play for these waves. Then allow also my general to play for dragon. Maybe hit mid tier one a lot times or bot oh i'm tipping bot i'm tipping bot here i can get maximum gold income i'm tipping bot i can get the full turret right and then maybe look for more camps look for this next side wave ultimately i want to expand my lead and i want to look for natural resources gotta dodge this key. yeah lux you're a sinner you gotta be perched right, open up your bible okay let's focus uh, okay, we got the tier 1 turret. We don't have ult, so I want to play a little reserved here. In the sense that, again, low deaths win games. Keep that in mind. Word for the good guys. Oh, oh, oh. You killed me last time, remember? Goodbye. I just little, little bit of auto attacks on his gentle forehead. Bah, 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 bah. I got my magic resist here, so he couldn't one-shot me. And he just died. That is kill. Now, we're just scaling to level 16. And it's going to be GG. The only issue, by the way, with going Lethal Tempo is that I don't have Fleet right now for Sustain and Sideline. Like, you'll see me play a lot of Fleet throughout the series because it gives you Perma Sustain on Champions, on Waves, on Turrets, on Camps, which is very nice. But now I have no Rift Maker and no Fleet, so I get zero Sustain, which kind of sucks. And now we're going to go for the Infinity Edge, like I said. So I want a Pickaxe. No, I don't. I want this. All right, let's go top. Like I said, it's hitting my wall. No, I'm not going to get the wrap off now. <laughs> We shouldn't just allow him to get everything for free. He didn't have his uh, jungle item completed yet. All right. Um, I can't do too much here, but I just want to push it out and then maybe look to roam to mid or something, right? That's my plan here. He got a full turret, which it's okay. It doesn't really matter too much. Look at this AOE, by the way. Yeah, kill us no wave to chat. Yeah! Let's get to 10 cents per minute. Where is this guy recalling? Let's keep checking items. One item. This guy's probably going to have an item when I see him again. Look at that wave clear chat. Ain't that beautiful. I mean, I'm also really strong. He doesn't have a full item yet. What is he doing? Oh, I'm coming, Amu. 
I got ult for him, in case he needs it. Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Play for the tier 3. Tier 3 turrets give gold now, chat. Dispatch tier 3 turrets give gold. So we will stay for it. I'm not gonna move mid. This will give me 400 tokens. Lux. You wanna get perched, you little bitch? Oh. Maybe purchase isn't the correct word. Maybe it is. I don't know. Oh. Oh! Holy moly! Oh, there's a side wave. Give me that. Come here, piggies. And now top wave too. Is there people coming? Could be a Lux Q flying. I'm slow pushing this wave a little bit. By slow pushing this, I allow no other wave. Okay, let's hard push. Alright, Lux, you are very annoying. I gotta kill this guy. Yeah, he has full blade on king. Just make sure you can never get close. Never good. Just movement thing. Oh, there's a cane. Alright, we kite it. What we buy better? Buff kill. Buff kill. And say fundamentals. G -G. One we buy better. One we buy better. Yeah, that was kind of crazy. I'm gonna be honest, chat. That gave me some dopamine. Oh, I'm TP for the tier 2. Hey, he's right. I'm not even 16 yet. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be fun when I get 16. Alright, well, that was kind of disgusting. I'm gonna be honest. And the thing is, this is why I love playing Kale so much. Like, see, I already said, right? I'm at the end. I, I've done uh, the, the race to masses first. Like, I've already hit masses. At the start, when I was playing Kale, I was actually, like, really bad at kiting. But here you also see I've gotten... So much better at kiting, and now, I don't know, this champion is just, just so strong. Like, if you know how to kite, you know how to itemize, and you just get 10 per minute easily with this champion, right? I don't know. Like, all you need to do is just play your early lane well, just have your fundamentals, your reset timers, your wave manipulation correct in the lane, check the junglers, play your waves correct, play your reset timers correct, and I feel like if you go even, you're gonna be a monster. If you go even a little bit ahead in lane, like, you're just... I don't know how you play against this champion, you know? Like, if this champion is ahead, you know that at level 16, kill is gonna carry the game. I already carried it before I even got close to level 16. And now my team is just smurfing too. Relax! Oh, that was one auto-attack. Kill Vega. Hello, level 16! La, 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 level 16! Well, okay, okay. I want to one-shot some people. Let's go. Ah! Yeah, I'll get the plus 50 then. Come on, Shelly. Do your dance. First game, boss mans. Let's go! Keep it going with the kill! Alright guys, second game here. Uh, I'm not betting anything because Momo did not raise a bitch. Alright, we got AP jungler. We got Vayne bot. Let's see what we run into. We are playing Black Halos. Zora matchup. I've played this matchup before. Uh, this is definitely a matchup. I'm going to go fleet. And I'm going to go for the scaling setup. So I go... Believe... Yeah, it's Celerity Gathering Storm. Now, you could argue that I could run um ghost in this matchup especially paired with celerity but it's fine you still get movement speed from uh your passive from your w those kind of things so i think it's fine i don't think i need extra movement speed this could also be a matchup where i'm going to rush play the rune king to have more damage onto him right but let's see how the matchup goes to explain the rest of my setup uh, i go fleet uh for sustain and I'll go health because Orn has mixed damage. His W is magic damage and his Q is physical damage. Um, he should mainly hit me with his Q, right? But sometimes I'll still get poked by his W, especially in the early game. So I'm just going to end up going for uh, health here. I think it's better. Um, it's full scaling setup with Gathering Storm. Um, 
Their team fighting already looks extremely strong, right? Belvet or Seraphine, that already looks extremely scary for me. But let's see here. Um, I think this is a draft where I'm just allowed to kind of play whatever I want because I have full AD bot side. Let's see what my jungler picks here, or what my mid laner is going to pick here, rather. The enemy team is relatively heavy AD, but it doesn't really matter for me. Okay, so here I have AD, 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 right? So here I'm probably going to go AP Kel. So here, the build that I have in mind is Kraken Slayer or Brave Rune King Rush. That is a must. That's what I do every game. I'm not going to rush Nasher's Tooth because you're simply too slow. So Brave Rune King or Kraken Slayer, probably Kraken. And then I go Nasher's Tooth, Rift Maker, Rabadons, something like this. So Kraken, Nasher's, then I get the only damage. Ra uh, Riftmaker, Rabadons, and then I'll be one-shotting everybody. So I go Kraken Slayer to have a better laning phase, and it's 80 damage, right? So I can just wave clear better, those kind of nice things. And then I go to Nashers for a little bit more damage, and then I'll go for the other. I mean, they got Belvet in the early game with Orn. Orn is playing Grass Precision. We got Diana. I would say that Diana is weaker than Belvet in the early game in terms of skirmishing. Um, same for Kale, so I think their topside 2v2 is definitely stronger than ours in the early game, so I'm mainly going to be playing... Uh, on a defensive side, like I don't want to force 2v2 scenarios, right? It's simply not beneficial for me, but what I can look to do is just the pr priority in the early game. Because, I mean, Orn can actually play this matchup quite kind of aggressive in the early game. So theoretically, Orn could look for priority here, but it's mainly going to come down to how he's going to execute this laning phase. In the sense that if he plays aggressive, it's going to be hard for me to walk up. But if he does not play aggressive, which a lot of Orns will not do, I can still get priority and I'll be in a good position. So let's see here. I'm going to look for my early game ward, so I know where both jungles are going to be pathing towards. And that's pretty much all I need to do. Alright, so I instantly stepped up here. Nobody showed in the bush, so nobody can be here. And I've gotten free access to this bush. Now we can chill here a little bit. I'll place my ward a little bit later. I want to instantly spawn it. What are you saying about Yordo skill? Shut up. Alright, let's put my ward down. And E-start, very standard. E-start is just a must because it allows you to secure passive easily too. Alright, because that's six stacks. You get attack speed and movement speed. So keep that in mind. All right. Um, yeah, we just want to get towards our level 16. That's very standard kill gameplay. And again, Kraken into Nash's Tooth into Rift Maker is the gameplay here. Kraken, Rush, Nash's Tooth, Rift Maker, Rabadons, most likely. Again, 80 damage, 80 damage, 80 damage. So going AP is fine. So I'm here, I'm going to let my E onto him instantly he's cooking egg. I don't like eggs. Kidding, I do. I'm gonna look for priority if I can, right? You see Orn's not hitting the main wave here? Okay, he is. He probably has Q start, so I'm trying to anticipate the Q here. I'm gonna E him. Drop the main egg right into the bush. Okay, his W start. Hit him every time and drop the main egg right into the bush, so the main stop hitting me. Almost lost that. I'm gonna try and prioritize my E on him, especially with fleet. If you hit fleet on your opponent, you heal more. If you hit fleet on means, it only heals you for a small amount. So try to prioritize your fleet on your opponent champ. Oh, that was not best for me. All right, try to prioritize fleet on your opponent if you can. I get my level up here. You got this level up too. We got a pretty good turret there though. Velvet is pathing top, so I gotta keep that in mind. Sidestep so that. All right, what are you doing? Not that weak, bro. Imagine I had lethal tempo. What? Also, your E is executes. I'm gonna put two points in Q here simply because I need to hard push this way before Belvet comes. I need this wave in. He's gonna TP. He has E, W. Let me secure the cannon. And then, I mean, just run away, I guess. He could E forward here. Need to get this to crash. Okay, nice. That's why I put two points in Q, right? Very weird early game. He's, like, he tried to play aggressive, but uh, yeah, that was not the angle, boss man. And now I got the crash. I am going to TP. We get the same reset here as last game. I wait a little bit for my refillable and I'll TP back. But remember, both Diana... Actually, I don't need to TP. You know why I don't need to TP chat? Look, these next means walked into the turret. And what this does is preserve his melee means here. I don't want to contest the spots anyway, because remember, I said we lose the 2v2 in the early game. So I don't want to fight the 2v2 because my main is walked into the turret range. I'm barely losing any means here, maybe one or twice max, right? But even if I do, it doesn't really bother me that much because ultimately I preserve my TP for one or two means, which is extremely worth it. And now I still have my TP. I didn't force a scenario where I maybe have to... No, I don't want to fight here. Because Belvet is here too, maybe. I don't want to fight here. I mean, chunking him is fine, I guess. Okay. Okay, now let's back off. We got a splash. This is good. I'm going to hold this wave. 
I cannot help him in River. If Diana fights the Belvet in River now, I cannot help. Or in Flesh, they're 345. He doesn't have Inspiration, so he doesn't have like the rune where it goes longer. So it's going to be 840. I'm going to say Top Flesh, and I'm timing that. I cannot help him here. <laughs> Diana's on her own. I'm going to hold the wave here. That's my priority here, to freeze. Ian, I can permanently sustain. I still have TP. We're in an absolutely perfect scenario. Orn is losing a full cannon wave here. And um, this is massive. Losing a full cannon wave in the early game. Because in the cannon wave, there is around 200 gold worth of means. But he also loses the XP. And the XP is even more costly. Because if I'm a level ahead onto him, that's worth 600 gold in terms of stats. So now not only does he lose 200 gold worth of like uh, CS here, he also loses the full cannon wave and all the XP. And uh, I would say so right there, losing a full cannon wave is just basically equivalent to getting solo killed. You don't win this fight, by the way. Yeah, I can just kill him here. He has no E, no flesh. I have level 5. Remember, level of time is shit. If I was level 4, I would never look for this. I think I win. Could be wrong. I was definitely wrong. Poor mouse. Yeah, I suck at the game. Level of times don't mean shit. Because I have fleet and no lethal tempos. If I have lethal tempo, I'm always good. But I don't. And I still don't want to live with so my champion. Okay. Hold the wife here. Hold the wife. Be very annoying. What are you doing? Okay, you have a death wish, my guy. I've got tier two boots. You're dead. You're a little piggy. Squeal for me, please. <laughs> Okay, now I need to set up my own reset. Why do I need to set up my own reset? Because I'm 1 HP. I don't want to continue laning like this. I'm not going to reset MTP. I'm going to try and push this out. It's a hard task, though, because I'm killed. So I got to be fast. Q all this shit. Okay, maybe I just tanked a little bit too much here. I got to slow push this. Hard push next. And I'm not sure if I'm going to get it in. I'm going to be extremely honest. I lost way too much health. Maybe I should just reset MTP and, and, and run back. I may have made the incorrect decision here. But let's see. Belvet should be both side again, so that's why I can also maybe get this in. I am pushing this because you see next wave. Okay, Belvet is coming top side. I saw her. She hasn't recalled yet, so that's good for me. So I she's not that strong here. And now all I need to do is push this in this wave. I don't need to do anything else. I don't care about the Orn. I don't care about trading. I need to get this wave in. It's gonna E forward. I need to pressure him a little bit off the wave. All I need to do is get this to crash. What? I just teleported. Okay, we got to crash. That was the most important part. Now we're not getting killed anymore. The wave's gonna bounce back into me because you see here, my means are going to walk through the turret, whereas his means are stuck here, right? And that ultimately means that this wave is gonna slow push towards me. I will buy double longsword, so I actually deal some damage with my auto attacks. Now we're in a good position. I got tier two boots. We're level seven. We're two and one. My entire team seems to be losing. I mean, we have CS leads. Oh, that's fine. Okay, he might hard push this wave. Yeah, he is. So I am I in time to collect? I think I'm in time to collect this because he didn't use his e key on E. Okay, so I'm gonna have a freeze here. My happy spot, Diana's here. I'm gonna ping here. I'm gonna ping the top flesh timer, and then I'm gonna say this. So he has no flesh, right? We can look to kill him here. Belvet could be here, but Belvet doesn't have items. Diana has items. I think we can win the two v two scenario just because of the item lead. Oh, that guy's dead. Wait. Okay, we have the wave in the happy spot. That means Orn is permanently forced to walk up for last hits. I tried to communicate with my Diana to gank, but she's gonna go bolt set for her camps, which is okay. Don't do much about it. Try to bait him to E. Yeah. I think I can just kill him because of the range advantage. Okay, now it's fine. Because he can get access to the plant, and I'm still not sure where Belvin's at. Oh, he has no E though. I have flash advantage too. Yeah, nice. Okay. We get the kill. We can also use that as a plate. And then probably recall. Maybe two plates. We max E now. Okay, I think I take two plates, yeah. Because Orn doesn't have TP. Belvedere is both sides. She bought her items. My entire team is losing. But maybe this is also more fun that my entire team is losing in the sense that I can show you guys how good of a 1v9 champion kill actually is. Like, this champion is definitely up there in terms of 1v9 potential. One of the best 1v9 top players in the game. Guaranteed. You see also there, but because I have two, double longsword, I can just Q the backline mains and auto take all of them with 4 points of Q. That's why I always use 4 points of Q. Maybe it's incorrect. Oh, you do gotta land the Q in order to have the wave there, Alois. Yes, you're right. Yes, you're right. My bad, Alois. It's okay, Alois. I forgive you. All right, Rico. We got two plates. We got the kill. We can get Noon Quiver and the bow. Holy shit, this bird is actually... Mmm. Mm. Mm. Sorry, I'm a pig. All right, uh, my entire team is losing. Uh, I'm gonna ask the boys. Boys, try stabilize. I'm kill and I'm fed. In game, IRL, we I'll carry. Okay, 
I make him joke, let me make a little bit, of, make him laugh a little bit, you know. All right, we win. I promise. Let's go, chess. Let's go. He has no ult. He has blush again, though. And that's why I preserved the timer. Yeah, and we are going to FF. I need to convince them to not FF. I need to just convince one guy to not FF. And then we're good. This guy's dead. Or he has to flush. I'm gonna wait. Get my Q first. I'm gonna use my E at the end as an execute. Oh, maybe I should have flushed E, but I'm not sure if it would have killed. It's okay, I'll force him to recall. Velvet could be playing top side. And Seraphim might be there too. Because Velvet wants to play for health, right? Vayne said, okay, I'll roam. That's fine for me, as long as you don't roam top. There could be a Belveth. Okay, well, that's not what I wanted to see. Uh, I was saying Belveth could be on Herald, not flying in my face. But hey, we dodged the Q very nicely. Uh, I gotta wait for one minute to get my TP. I wanna try to get to 1k gold. So now, it's gonna be very hard for me to set up my... I'm gonna flash this. I don't know yet, ult already. Uh, I'm gonna have to use my TP to get my next reset realistically. And I want to try and get towards 1k gold, so that when I TP back, I'll at least have my Kraken Slayer. And I can always summon my refillable. I prefer to keep my D-Blade, because we're already super far ahead across the game. My face is just roaming here. Are you kidding me? I'll attack him, so I get more fleet healing. Right, instead of hitting minions. You are not aware of how to use your combo, I believe, Mr. Orn. A more sustain. A more sustain. That's why fleet is so nice. I can, I'm pretty confident I can move in this game. Alright, let's harpish this. Ooh, they killed the Velvet. Let's say, well played. Nice. They actually get some shit here, and they might kill the one too, or get his flesh. Okay. Vayne instant response, so she gets dopamine. Orn died. Um, he has TP, I'm pretty sure. But I'm just staying here, because I can use my TP to get a reset myself as well. I think, yeah, again, I need to go... Kraken into Nashers, and then after Nashers, I will take Riftmaker. He should TP. He's not TPing. Trying to get as much as I can here in this timer, because nobody's here, right? If I can just reset like this, then I don't have to TP. I can preserve my TP, which is also really good. Let's proc these all, box the others, set up my Q. Oh! Ow, ow, ow. Oh! Nice job! The Yon doesn't know how to use his lead chat. A lot of players don't know how to utilize the lead. They still play it only for kills, but you shouldn't. We're going to be spamming our natural resources. I'm going to TP top here because I need to try and get this turret before these two piggies start roaming the map and making the game unplayable for me. Let's here. I got my Kraken Slayer procced. I need to get some more plates. In the E. I just want to put this guy to 1 HP so that if the Belvet ganks me here, I can maybe look to 2v1. I'll go Belvet has Tabbies. Okay, I gotta be careful. Yeah, I don't have flesh. I'm gonna push in this wave and look for gold. Oh, I'm definitely getting ganked. I'm gonna ult here to basically block all the incoming damage, but I might still just be dead. Yeah. There's no counterplay to that triple knock up threat. I, sh I was even very close to my turret, but. I guess it should be further away even. Come on, man. I just need one homie that is not going to affect the game. Alright, it sucks that I died there though, because not only do I die, they get, basically get my full turret, because my Diana's AFK. Okay, I gotta play like a mental warrior here too, you know? I gotta, I gotta keep one homie convinced that we can win this game, because I'd love to play out this game. Nice! Mental boost for the boys! Okay, let's just flush two. I should be able to get this. 
Okay, they got three kills. That's pretty massive. Okay. Here's my blue trinket. Can I get it before the third plates? Oh, you're kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, man. It's all good. I can't tilt. I wanna start going both sides soon. And I need to start taking as much farm and camps as I can. Okay. Who's gonna come topside here then? I will push the second wave if Orn is here. They're gonna pop a dragon. Seraphine is here. Ezra might come too then. Kinda sucks. You gonna walk forward into me? That's kind of really weird. I'll she path there. Guys, no flash. I don't know what the hell Seraphine was doing there. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take a kill trait. I think kill traits are fine. I wish I could have dodged the Q, maybe. Or the W. If they kill this, it's massive, though. It's a massive shutdown for the Vayne. Oh, she's so tilted. <laughs> she's not gonna recover from that mentally, is she? <laughs> Me, bot, no. I gotta convince the Vayne to not run bot here. I gotta run fast, I gotta run fast. This is my side wave, Vayne can catch this. Woo! Yeah, I understand. I just need to keep these guys in the game. At least they haven't FF yet. But now I also need to stop dying and focus on my own gameplay. I need to get to 10 cents per minute. I need to get as many resources as I can. I'm still strong, right? But I need to get a lot stronger. I'm not that strong, right? If I can get the skill and the shutdown, I'm instantly back in the game. Okay, well, this is gonna make the game extremely easy to win now. You don't give Alois and L gold. Remember, you do not give Alois and L gold. Now it's GG. I'll flash for that because I needed it. Double buffs, dopamine, shutdown, and pressure for the tier one here. Okay, I have my item in base already. Now I just need to go. I think what I'll do is I'll just mute all. And so I can focus on myself here because this cane is kind of annoying, or this vein is kind of annoying me. I think I've convinced my team to at least keep playing this game. I only need three more levels and GG. Okay, hope my team is convinced. This is really good. The Ord is completely useless. He has hearts too, but I don't necessarily need the Blade on the King. I still one shot him. This is Yon. Velvet could come both side again as well. I gotta keep in mind that I don't have ult. I can one shot this turret under his nose though. He's not that strong. He only has one item. Oh, I walked into that. You gonna queue forward? What? Are you are you an idiot? Idiot sandwich? <laughs> Look at how much sustain I get with fleet, by the way. Oh, I saw Ezreal. Oh my days. I'm just dead. But I'm gonna stand here. They will never expect me to walk this way. Now Rico here. They're gonna expect me to walk here. <laughs> Why did they know? It's okay. Keep going, keep going, keep going, chat. We gotta need this, and then we're gonna be fed. In game IRL. <laughs> Kill this guy. Nice, oh, well done. I get my assist. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Do I dash by this? Maybe TP here. I need 20 seconds. Okay, yeah, this guy's playing it well. Don't think he wins. Velvet is too strong with two items. Yeah. I need to get tier 1 bot. Make get pressure here. Ah. Uh, I'll TP both here. The only risk I run into is that I won't have my TP for Nash when it spawns. But I don't care. I need to speed up my gameplay here. Pike can move here. How did Vayne die again? Okay, Ezreal's two and a half items. Belvet is two and a half items. Right? So Belvet and Ezreal are my biggest threats. I know Seraphine is no flesh. I think neither are both side right now. I hope. So I want to play for this both tier one. And I should be able to. Pressuring him off the wave. I have one shot this turret. I'm gonna act as if I'm walking away, force him to walk back up. He doesn't, okay. Try to bait him to walk back up there. I need level 16, chat. That's what I need. Kill can one v nine in this game, even if I already have four deaths. Okay, that's nice. I ain't got a kill, so maybe she's happy finally. Once in a life. Maybe not. I'm not gonna respect it. 
I don't know what that guy's doing, but I'm taking the skill. I need the XP. What the f I should win that if I ult. But I didn't expect we will get one shot like that, bro. Oh, no. What is Belved even as a champion, man? Ay, 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 ay. This is not good, chat. This is gar nicht good. If I kill the Belved and I probably get the bot here 2 turret, then, like, this game is over, right? But I'm making too many mistakes myself as well. I'm close to 3 this now, though. But still, she's gonna Herald here and get this tier 2 turret. So she kills me, she gets these side waves, and she gets a tier 2 turret. So she kills me, boom, gold. She gets a side wave, boom, gold. Then she gets this tier 2 turret, that's 800 more gold. So she's gonna have 3 items here, minimum. So, yeah, it's a hard game. And this, this guy's just perma AFK as well. Like, he doesn't have a jungle item to finish it. She's more, like, 100 CS down. If I can get this kill here, if she overstays, I'm gonna be so happy if I can get this kill. But I don't think she will. Unless she's inting. We're almost level 16 though. I haven't seen a single FF vote yet. Can you like not do that? Ah, they got three dragons now too. Maybe I shouldn't do this. Not for a wolf camp, Alois. My bad. Sorry. <laughs> My bad. Sorry, that was a fat cope. Uh, if he gets the third, I can keep my. D no, this guy's still have items too. They're all so strong. My Cassandra can, or actually, can never win this. It's the first one. Okay. Well, that was like luster. We're gonna defend here. I need to stop dying. That's my first goal, chat. I need to stop dying like a piggy. That's massive. Or use ult. I don't mind that for Vayne dying. They should wait for me though. Wait for me. You piggies. Little piggies. I'm a pig myself. Wait, me dying, you they end the game now. Why zero patience? We went in one by one by one by one. That's so depressing. I'm playing it so poorly too. If I play a little bit better, I can carry this game. But I keep dying myself. That sucks. Well, I ha I have seven deaths. If I play better, these are definitely carryable games. But uh, yeah, my entire team afk would I think I could have won this had I played better, made some better decisions. It really started getting hard after I died to the... Velvet no, and both sides, but it happens. These games happen, right? We did our best. Last deaths, I could have carried this. All good though. Let's move on. Oi, what is this? Akali. Uh-oh. I think that's an OO angle. All right. So, I mean, I'm gonna go crack and wits end this game. Or maybe just wits and rush. What about wits and rush this game? Wits and rush, maybe? I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be sidelining against AP champions this game anyways. Just no term. Like, this game is hard for me because I have two champions that are going to be dashing onto me permanently, right? But let's read my passive, though. I didn't even know she gets 10% movement speed. F5 stacks. I didn't know that. I knew this is an execute because it deals more damage based on missing health. Yeah, that makes pretty much sense. I'm gonna go E start. Where are you, little piggy? That's not good. He's D blade start. Respectable. Shit, shit, shit. If she had E there, I probably would be way more screwed. But still pretty bad for me. How does she know my range that perfect? She has D-Blade, so she doesn't have that much to stand, right? Neither do I. It's better to let the Lesset go. Because neither of us is sustain. She gets level up prior now. It's not the end of the world. Money, money. Thank you so much. Hey bro, I'm a duchy, and I know you from my YT shorts. Love your content on the fundamentals would you mind giving some quick pointers after this game? I play both solo queue, flex. Okay boss, thank you for the 10, yes, absolutely for that. I had to dodge that. I dodged the queue. 
Okay, I think the level 1 trade that I did was just so horrible and it completely ruined my laning phase because I also gave up my bomb by thing like that. The level 1 trade was really, really bad that I did. Uh oh. Bro, my trap is dog shit. I gotta recall. I ain't it. I was like, I don't fear she got a level 4. I lose the cannon. It is what it is. I've griefed. I get the XP, I think, though. Nice. I griefed really, really hard. I was playing aggressive even though I shouldn't. That's pretty much it. Oh my days. I'll check your um, OBRG after the game, boss. Thank you again for the 10, my fellow Dutchman. Yo, join a bug. Good to see you, boss. Alright, chat. So, I'm gonna be having to play out this bounce, and my main goal is to just not die. If I get this bounce in without dying, then I'm happy, I guess. At least my Maokai stops side, but I think Notch just stops side too. Thank you for the prime, boss. That guy is good. Uh, the faster I push this wave, the faster it will bounce back into me. I got level 5 before we're here. I don't need you. Let's slow push this wave. He took my XP, man. This guy's playing really dis uh, respectful, rather. Compared to the gear in last game, right? This Akali is probably a smurf as well. She knows what she's doing. Good practice for me. I don't think Nocturne is here. Yeah. Oh, that should land everything. My bad. Wave will push into me. Am I on vision? No. Nocturne's coming top side. 40 CS hasn't recalled yet. I'll do this, no. Alright, I mean, I lose nothing for it. This Nocturne is gonna be level 6 really fast this game. Because he's already going to be on 40 CS and he has these two camps as well. Oh wait, she might dive me. This Akali is definitely a sort of running demolish here. What a goat. It's all good though. Now it's gonna get the hardest part in lane though. I don't have flash, the wave's pushing towards her. She's gonna have item lead. This is where I probably will die, chat. This is just where I'm gonna be most vulnerable, right? So there's two kind of tricks that I can try and use, which is try to make Akali Q me and the wave, so the wave will bounce back into me again, but it's pretty much impossible to do here. So I get to pray here, hard push this wave and not die. Oh, well. She didn't, or she had to recall. Use E to get close at least. There's a plant in the river currently that I can play for. Okay. This was the only wave I was like super gank one. Yeah, level 7 here. She has no potions. Okay, nice. Switch that. Motion is level 6, but he should be both side again. Level 7 too. Okay, let's recall. Or play the. Uh, plant. Not played, not recall. Plant. No plant. Just cannon. Alright, we're dead even in CS. Decent. 
especially after my horrible early. And the wave's pushing back into me right now, which is amazing, chat. So whenever wave's pushing into me, I'm basically not forced to walk up for last hit, right? Meaning I'm not really gankable here, or can't really get killed unless I walk up for last hit that I'm not supposed to walk up for. All right, Nocturne's bot is level six. Uh, yeah, okay, it's level six. But as long as this wave's pushing towards me, this is where I'm happy, right? I'm never vulnerable in these scenarios because I'm super not forced to walk up for last hits. I think Ari actually... Oh, no. But yeah, as long as it is like this, I'm very happy. Make the trade. Double eight. Yeah, nice. I'm gonna be one SCS ahead, chat. Pogars. Oh, and base TP again soon. Nocturne's coming top side, so this is the way where I'm vulnerable again. I wanna try and hard push this before Nocturne comes here. I feel very scared. If I get this in, I won't be gankable again. Nice. Really massive. Nice. Nice, I don't even have to TP. I'm not gonna save for the play because Nocturne is top side and Maokai is both side. And let's hope this play works for my team. I lose the play, but it is what it is. Short price to pay. I don't buy potions here. Oh, I actually don't even lose the play. I'm gonna keep my TP. I don't buy potions because I'm relatively close to my myth or my wit sand, right? The 950, uh, it's kinda hard push this way, but that's okay. I got one way to get a free recall, which is TP. So. As long as I can keep scanning like this, I think I'm happy, right? So I'm just playing with fundamentals, reset timers, wave manipulation. There were two opportunities where I was super gankable, and yeah. Boots? Actually, maybe boots were good, but yeah, I don't know. Alright. She could roam. Okay, Noxion is still top side. This wave is relatively close to my side, so as if I last it at latest frames, I'm still not really gankable here, right? So I'm always thinking about how can I put myself in an as safe position as possible. Okay, Akali's actually mid. Time to hard push. I did ping. Oh, she dies. Ak Akali used ult at least, and I lose cannon. Do not ping me, because I will get mildly frustrated, upset, angry, and annoyed. I'm a raging child when I lose cannon, okay? And this, this guy's here. Of course he is. Okay, we're gonna have wood sand. I push this. Alrighty, so we got wood sand. I think I can stat check her now a little bit. By Super 2. Next item. Nashers. Rift. She doesn't have old. Good. Now I'm gonna start training a little bit more aggressive, right? I'm also assuming Nocturne is both side right now. Then I could have done a little bit of a better trade there if I at least land my Q. Because I'd slow her and break her armor and magic resist, right? Nocturne is both. Nice. Now we can finally start playing aggressive. Both globals have been used. I don't have sustain with fleet, but I got the PTA damage. We'll just stand this per minute. She has TP. I think she's gonna base TP. I 
The more plus like oh yeah, okay, there she is. Um She's still not too close to a mythic. I don't think I should go for the plant now. I do want to though. <gasps> oh I shouldn't, I shouldn't, I shouldn't, I shouldn't, I shouldn't, I shouldn't. She might E ult me. Okay, yeah, that plant was a death sentence. I have no TP, but her heart pushing the wave is good. I can farm it again for about 1100 gold. Yes, sir, Riven buffs. I'm just very curious to see what buffs they'll actually do, though. This is how a lot of kill games are gonna go, though, chat. Like, I don't really have that much agency as my champion, right? She's probably gonna hard push this wave, maybe look for plate. If she doesn't hard push, I reset. If she hard push, I stay. I wanna try deny her this uh, plate, right? Okay, level 11 achieved! That wasn't that hype. I just tried to make it hype. Are you guys hyped? Kali could roam. I have a feeling that Kali's roaming, yeah. Good job, team. I'm just playing with my wife still. Get a full tier 1 turret. Uh oh. Chat, that's his NOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOO
It's hard to kill these guys. I'm just farming natural resources, legit zero kills this game. And those eyes on flesh though. Bait. I wonder why his eyes no flesh yet. I wonder why his eyes no flesh. Oh wait, I know. You ping the AD carry pick to ping away from your side lane. Please, stop it, stop it, Tristan. Me. 400 for this. You can get this wave and I'll leave, please. You should be mid. I don't care. Oh, that's good. Let's just give him a tier 1. Why not? Cherry took my cannon. I'm calling mother. Alright, Cherry, we have two items. Now we're gonna play for the tier 2 natural resources. We're just scaling, though. Let's run top. I have one kill, yet I'm two full items. Natural resources. Let's continue gathering. Let's continue gathering the resources, chat. It's like a mini game. Level 40! Level 40! Do I hear 15? I'm not that good. But there's topside camps. There's a blue spawning. Running. Tristan is gonna farm for the sideline. Unlucky. Ooh. One. Camp has been spotted. Isn't this guy just dead? GG. I hear level 15 coming. I hear level 15 coming, chat. What if I reset? TP bolt, get this wave, get the next wave, and get the tier 2. And actually not play here. I'm just picking my team away, and I'm gonna TP bolt. And I can also get the dragon. And I can also get your... I don't know, something. Level, 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 level 15! Rogan champion, let's go. Alright chat. We're fat. In-game IRL. Getting natural resources. If you get macro on the champion, you'll be fine. We're getting our level 16. Look at these three camps. Oh, that's a nice flash by Soraka. Actually, I th there's two people here, one person here. I don't think Talia's gonna defend here. So they might move mid as well. Because they're scared we're gonna do Nash, so I'm gonna play for this tier 2. I think my assumption here is right. I don't see Talia. Where's my ult? Where's my ult? Where's my ult? Where's ult? Where's ult? Why my bots? It's okay. Should I need to blasting ult this game? Maybe I go Nashes to it, right? Uh, I should have just went for these three cams and preserve my 1k shutdown. 
and preserve my flash. That was really bad, actually. Oh, no, wrong that was really bad, because first of all, I don't get a tier 2 turret. Akali gets this tier 2 turret. I lose my 900 gold, and I don't get these three camps. That was a really bad decision. Really bad decision. <laughs> Excuse me. Terrible decision by the young Alois. Let's go. Celerity Gathering Storm. Should I try Celerity Gathering Storm instead, chat? Should I try Celerity Gathering Storm? I'm, I'm watching this Korea kill and he plays like this always, but I guess I could try it. Because Korea plays more aggressive than you. Dude, farming John camps as kill is actually s addicting. Look at this shit. Dish, 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 dish. Alright, let's get our item. Let's go. Yeah, I'm going to on hit build this game. If I go AP, I'll go Rift Maker, but with on hit, I should not go Rift Maker. No, with on hit, I should go this. I either play the on hit build or I play for the AP build. AP, I'll go Rift Maker. Yo, there's so many jungle camps. There's too many things for me to do at once, man. Look at this shit. It's too nice. Still can't see so many autos. I should probably improve my settings that I don't have to actually click on the champion. I still hit. Like, I have it that when I A-click, like, I have to hit the champion. I know a lot of people have the settings where you actually, like, can click next to the champion and it would still hit. I don't have that setting. That's why I maybe suck in the range champions. Watch this child though, if she goes for the wave. Cringe. That damage, though. Plus one K for the boy. Uh, maybe not worth, maybe not worth, maybe not worth, maybe not worth, maybe decent. It's okay. Should we should get Nash, right? Surely. Where's the Maokai W? There it is. Oh yeah, we get Nash. Oh yeah, it's hella worth. Can can you wait for me so I get Would be nice, you know. Would be would be nice to share. Today we talked to the most calculating and one of the most consistent Riven players in the entire world. Well, we still gotta do some damage. Set Chonker, thank you for the prime. No Borg? Wait, you're right. I should get Borg. I completely forgot about Borg. I forgot Borg exists. Oh, well. Sucks. Yeah, I should have won Bork. You're right. Why is this guy walking bot again? I don't even think he knows. Now what? Now what? What are you gonna do next? I win. Stop it, Eddie Carry Man. I'm gonna 1v5 here, I guess. Can I also give a reasoning? Okay, now the reasoning is taking my side wave, which is a legal business. That's okay, we'll take that. Okay, let's continue. Ooh, we got a banger. We got a banger song. 2.5 attack speed. That's max. Let's go. Bro, Tristan, I killed her for bot. Then why you troll her? My bad. Well, it's good for Tristan to be bot here, I guess. Like the whole game, she's been trying to go bot. That's okay. This song brings me back to Korea. Look at this Tristana. Ain't no way she's gonna go bot again, right? Would be a banger actually if she does. I respect it if she does. I mean, not sure where she's going. Okay, let's focus now though, because I've died a few times and we don't control the game completely anymore. I'm gonna take this. 
I can ult you if you come. See, chat, no ego. I still ult her. I still ult her. She might take my side wave. But she can't take my owner. I would still ult her. Still gonna, play, still gonna be team player. I saw an angle! Bye. Kale is weak. Kale is weak. Kale is weak. Why is this guy typing? I see so many people saying Kale is weak. I don't see it. I don't see it. He's a weak laner, yes. But I had zero kills this lane. I just farmed. I just had the, the funny manual farming. And then... Uh, the natural resource gathering and now we are late game kill level 18 almost full build we watched everything did you kale is strong if your opponent is a donkey this this akali was honorably a pretty good laner Kill Little Tempo is pretty strong level 1 though, yes, but I don't play Little Tempo. I don't see this guy going Little Tempo. This Korean guy always plays Fleet or PTA. But then again, Korea is a different server to Europe, bro. All six camps are up. I'm just gonna full clear. Yo, chat, you know what? You know what? It's time to full clear. I just wanna do a little bit of thing. Can we all just get in the zone? I just get satisfaction. Satisfaction. <gasps> Don't take away my full clear, you disgusting pig. Why are you taking my jungle? How much did we make? 2.6. GG. Full clear done. Let's go. Satisfying. I can't control this much attack speed, by the way. I have no idea how to control this. I'll be very, 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 very honest. Ooh, jungle camp? Ooh, don't mind if I do. Probably. How fast do I push turrets? I mean, we're full build, but we didn't have to. Watch this guy die. Hello, guys. I'm Aloys. Today we are going to do a coaching in the top lane. Solo Bolo. Thank you so much, Glorified, for the Prime. Dude, my damage is so ridiculous now. It's kind of crazy. They don't really have a lot of engage, so it's kind of easy for me to play this draft. If Maki just stands in front of me, they can't do shit. Ah, I ulted Maokai. Oopsie daisy. Yeah, just farm roll, and you'll be good on the champion. I don't know if I, I need to learn to be better in lane, because I really grieved my lane in the early game, but... Like, the thing is, like, the thing is, with this MMR chat, even if I make quite some mistakes, I will always be able to farm back up, because people don't have good tempo or macro understanding in this MMR. Kill into Aurelia. Now that's a death sentence. I don't want to do it. I kind of don't want to do it. Go ignite lethal tempo, you can win. I should ignite. More than a race, no bitch, you're right. You're right. It's locked in. I'm gonna look for the first ward here. You know? Fun mental ward. I'm warding here so I know where enemy jungler is going to start clearing to, okay? Um... Movement. 
Uh, Proker bone plating too, hopefully. Yeah, but it kind of sucks here. Are they just allowed to do this battle? I'm going to have to recall. 113, you can still recall. I hope my teammates do something here. 113. No, I can't recall anymore. It's too late. Well, FF. They're both sitting in this bush. I kind of ruined my lane here, level 1, I'll be honest. Uh, looks like both genres are pathing to bot here, though. So that's good for me. Uh, if I run the leashes, I can at least get priority for free. I just leashing. Normally, I would be able to stand in this bush and cheese her here because I'm playing Ignite, but now I'm too low HP. Actually, maybe I still can. Aurelia is one of the weakest level 1 champions. I think I win here with Little Temple and Ignite. Yeah, she's walking around. So she might lose XP right now because she was leashing. She lost XP here, which is big. It delays her level up. I'll check out my bone play thing. Yeah. Alright, I'm probably gonna have to do a third wave crash so I can just recall. At least both jungles are patting into bolt, so I don't have to be scared of like jungle ganks here, right? I'm at least playing level one here, get a bone plating out. Oh, she dies here. The wave is pushing towards her, but I have to recall. It sucks. It really, I really hate it. I dislike it. It's absolutely horrific, but we have to do it. No, I'm gonna stay. No, I'm gonna recall. Fundamentals, GG. See, it's like an impossible decision. You, you know why, chat? If I recall, right? If I recall, I lose. So I was, I was not going to stay to push the wave. Listen, I was going to stay to push as many means and then recall because if i recall listen 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 if i recall i'd lose the full cannon wave and the full next wave which is total like 300 gold so it's pretty much it's even it's even bad right it's even bad uh but now i die and i lose the million so it's even worse you get but i almost got the cannon xp right she would have frozen yes she would have but it's okay now we have item lead it's okay um we gotta try and kill it on this wave now I should just recall though. That's completely my bad. I'm a griefer. I hope I can bait Aurelia to like contest me here. Somehow. Okay, I don't want her to contest me. She's level 4. I lose. I missed everything too. Oh, why are you here? Nah, I shouldn't have. I just died to his auto. I died to a card as auto attack. How is he already top lane again? He just died to Lilia. How is he already top lane again? Now oh, the game's so over, by the way. Oh, if they share EXP here, I'm actually fine. Okay, they share a lot of EXP. It's somewhat doable. It's actually okay ish. It's okay ish. We can maybe stabilize. Maybe. Hey, it's so doable, by the way. What do you think about respawn timers change? Uh, it's kind of cringe, paired with the fact that. Means walk a lot faster, right? So I think TP is kind of a must on most champions right now. I'm playing with a guy, by the way. I gotta just have to let her crash. I can maybe cancel her base once, though, which will delay her bounce opportunities. All right, so this is really good, just canceling her. I'm gonna cancel her again. Nice. Now she at least stayed. So now she can't kill me on the bounce. And now I get the opportunity to slow push this hard push next. I actually can cancel her base one more time. She's recalling here now. Nice. And now I can slow push this wave, hard push next, and I get my reset in. And she can't kill me on the bounce. This was massive. Even though it doesn't look like it, it's absolutely massive what I did here. The only thing I'm scared of is card is maybe repeat ganking top here. Okay, now she's kind of stuck in lane, right? I want a proxy, but I don't know where card this is at. That ah, sucks. I could recall. Maybe that's just a good play here. She's gonna hit level 6 here, right? So I think it's just better for me to recall. She lost cannon, GG. 
I don't get a long sword either. I didn't even get my dagger. I'm not gonna run back because she's gonna hard push this. Every second I save by running here, she might not get a, this wave to crash. I'm making a lot of mistakes here though. Of course, she just buy a dagger there. And she didn't really hard push it because what I really can do is press W and spam Qs and it's fine. Alright, I want to try the same thing here. She preserved most of her mana, I guess, to try and push this. I need to get my level 6 here. So I can try and stop her from crashing this wave. Hey, chat, this is all a result of me cancelling Aurelia's recall four times, though. That's why you use fundamentals. Reset timers is an integral part of your fundamentals. Look, this guy still only had his D-Blade. Now that's all a result of me cancelling his recall a few times. There you go, yes. Your spear should know. GG. GG. Right? It was the long con. We're playing the long con game. Just ignore the fact that I'm a disgusting pig. I need to get 1.3k gold so I can get Noon Quiver. I put 4 points in Q so I can actually just one-shot waves. I want to play it. See, it loses my tempo, but I get my Noon... <laughs> Alright, we don't want to play it. Uh, this reset kind of sucks now because Kill gets enough time to push this wave. Or sorry, Arelas. And I lose the... Oh my days. It is so doomed now. I can recall. See, now they're doing it to me. Please slow push. Please don't hard push. He should always hard push. You know why he should hard push? If he hard pushes this wave, he gets two plates. The wave will bounce back into me. I can play the game. By him slow pushing, I'm allowed to play the game. Thank you very much. Do I just sell this thing? Yes. No. Let's run. Okay, see, Aurelia doesn't have the fundamentals. He doesn't know to hard push here and to get plates and to make the wave bounce back into me. Or to, to, to her, rather. Because if she makes this wave push back into her, I'm going to be forced to walk up for last hits. If I'm forced to walk up for last hits, I can't play this match. Right? She has flesh, she has, she has ult, she's Aurelia, she's a creature, and I die. That's okay. By her slow pushing, I'm basically allowed to collect more waves. So it's actually good for me here. Yes, I'll put it on YouTube, boss. All right. And now I also get my ultimate timer back. Alright, I'm tickling this guy's balls. I don't really do damage. I'm gonna try and thin this out, or this wave out as much as I can. Because if I can hold this wave here, it's really, really beneficial for me. Because here I'm never gankable. Aurelia is always gankable, right? I don't think I kill her here. But I'm gonna try to hold this wave here. See, chat, this is what I refer to. As the happy spot. Now, don't sexualize it. This is the happy spot. You know why? I'm never gankable here. Aurelia is always gankable, right? I can farm for free here. She isn't really allowed to use abilities aggressive onto me because I'm so close to my turrets. So, what a perfect position here. GG. Okay, well, I should have maybe communicated with that. I'm gonna hold the freeze here, though. There's nothing I can do about that. And it's a shutdown. That's unlucky. <coughs> I'm gonna keep holding the wife here though. Should have communicated the wrong timer. That's completely my bad. <laughs> yes, it's the happy spot series shot. Can't wait for you to use it. It's GG here. Look, it might lead into a solo kill. Any happy spot enjoyers? Any happy spot enjoyers? Again, fundamentals. Fundamentals. Proof of concept. I don't need mechanics. I don't need a brain. I just need fundamentals. I set up my kills through them. And it's GG. Any happy spot that George is in the chat? There you go. GG. <gasps> ah, I'm just dead. I'm gonna focus the wave. Wait, he's shit. He's the best. I mean, what can I do there? By level 4 Q then E, because with Q... Why, with 4 points in Q and 1 auto attack on the backline main, I can one-shot them. At least we've stabilized the lane somewhat. Uh, this wave is actually just completely neutral. It's all RNG, whatever keeps pushing. You see, when I click on my means here, you see how my means are 0% uh, percent and their means are 0%. Percent. Usually, uh, either team will have a little bit stronger means due to level leads uh, across the board, let's say. Enemy team collectively at higher levels, their means would also be stronger. But here, I guess I just RNG'd and the wave is actually pushing to me. So I'm, I'm lucky here. I just got lucky. 
Okay. Um, this guy has no ult and no flash. She has no Blazor King yet, so she's half a champion. I need to space close so I can use my Q. Lovely. Right there, it's better for me to actually space with her and not use my auto attacks because by using auto attacks there, I stay in the same position. But by waiting for my Q, I guarantee the kill. All right, now we're in a good position. I'll stay for one plate. I think she has TP. So if she TPs, I'm going to react by walking downwards here. Yeah. So nobody can kill me here. And I got the wave too. She looks to be chasing me, right? Else she'd be on this wave. I'll walk away. And why not double dip? Double dipping here. Yon, don't look me. Close your eyes. Alright, here we go. <clears throat> there we go. Now we got Kraken Slayer. And do we go AD build or AP build? Now that sucks. People that cancel your recalls are piggies. I've done it a lot this game though. Alright, I'm um, close to level 11 now. I've ignited, so in that Hello, regard, guys. we're okay. Hello, Thank you, you're live for the two, oh, boss. Good to play. see you. Hope you're doing amazing. Maybe a level layer. So, I still lose because she's Blade Runner King. That champion becomes twice as strong with that item completed. What do you think of Arelia at the moment? She is decent as a counter pick, not as a blind pick. But yeah, in this game, she's really good, right? Because we have zero hard CC besides Morgana, Q, and ult, right? So, at this game, she's really good. I should go AP. So, what's my next item then? Uh, is it Nash's Tooth? Kill, is it? Kill one minute. Is it Nash's Tooth next? Nash's Rift, okay. Let's recall. Leave the ward here. We can. I mean, Lilia probably wants to look, but I actually don't want to. I have my item now. I'm pretty happy recalling here. Uh, we're gonna go for it. She has no flash. She should wait for me to gap close. Yeah, wait for me to get close, bro. Alright, take my wave. Alright, bro. I'm gonna recall. Alright, so she just wants to die. I have no mana, I don't wanna stay. I'm very happy I recalled, I'll be honest. I don't know what that guy's doing. Alright, let's get a rep off. That's the benefit of him dying. Alright, there's a positive to every negative in life, usually, generally speaking. My general griefing, I can take his rep off at least. Alright. Yo, Noah Ben, good to see you, boss. Noah Ben, the tier 3 goat. Thank you so much, man. Hope we're doing amazing, boss. God, this is really fat here. Yeah, it's not who a good coach is. Technic, thank you, Prime. I mean, I don't I know can. if I can cancel this. This guy's level 11, you know? Oh, I should dodge that. I'd rather ask you too. I could have played that better for sure. I use my e I should use my ears and execute. Okay, I can at least get the full turn with that. Can I get a flush? That was a kill though. Oh, that pitch. Oh. Ah, I can't kill this guy. I mean, we're in a good position now. We are going to be scaling. We're two levels up. If you're ahead in the exp <sighs> Sucks. If you're ahead in the XP and scale, you're in a good position, right? Because you you know you just need to get that level 11 and, and then we're chilling always. Thank you for tier 3 against Noah, Ben. I 
We just gotta scale now, though. We've used our cooldowns there. Flush, ult, ignite, everything. Oh, wait, that doesn't die, of course. Mm. Yo, Sonoka, good to see you. Oh, my days. I mean... I read that, please just push this wave. She's on Herald. She's on Herald. Completely flipped it, let's go. Oh. I want this. Hello guys, I'm Aloys. Today we are gonna do I a need it. in the top lane. <laughs> I'm Finally gonna got out of bronze. Riven and Scion as my go-tos. Okay. Well done, boss. Salute, can I get some salutes? Thank you for the two. Good job getting out of bronze. Let them piggies know. It's crazy that I actually got this wave and the turret. This already should always be killing me here. Hey, but we're happy. Let's go. Okay, we need 300 more gold. This side wave gives me 200 gold. Now, wow, Ben. Thank you, the five boss. This guy is really, really fat in game. I don't know. Um, Holy this guy's tricky. Moly. Thank you, boss. I'm gonna push this wave. I think I really is scared of me, but I'm scared of her. All right, we res or sell refillable, and I'm gonna go bot. I'm gonna say me bot now. I don't have TP, so I'm a bit slower on the map, but I'm gonna say me bot because I want to play for the bot tier one turn and expand my lead. Uh, next item is going to be. Wow, that's the sexiest thing I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty sexy. Yo, lion, thank you for the 25, man. My man. That's crazy. My man. Thank you guys for your generosity. What a crazy stream. Thank you, bros. You're all, you're all too kind. Thank you. That's, that's, that's crazy. Salute, boss. Right, we win Sideland against either champion. Uh, I gotta keep the folks up here though, because this is like the key moments in the game. If I play well here, we'll be fine. If I play poorly, uh, they'll get too strong for me to contest them. We're still ahead in terms of EXP in this game, so that's good. But we're behind in gold on the card, that's for sure. Okay, Mika Justice with the 5 as well. Out of nowhere, GG. Wow, that was the sexiest thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> <gasps> All right, no, thank you for the 30. Thank you for making me a billionaire chat. Thank you. Oh, shit. I gotta get this. I gotta shut down. I gotta get rich in game too. That guy is good. Okay, kidding. Thank you, chat, for um, yes, all that coaches, tokens. That you guys are uh, a bit goaded. I can't focus on two things. Let, you're making me multitask. I can't. And yeah, now Hello, I die. Guys, I'm Today we are gonna do a it's okay. In the top lane. Thank you, chat. I want to bait here. Wow, that was the sexiest thing I've ever seen in my life. Nice. XP for the boys. It's not a solo kill, so don't get that much XP, but a kill is a kill. Thank you, everybody. GG. Okay, uh, if my own dice here, I can one mid. I really ass here. Oh, actually, I might be able to get a tier to turret if I really ass there. Lily has taken the same. Oh, there's a Carfus. Let's recall them. We could do Nash. Chat, never buy Leeching Leer. This item is useless. Why is it useless? 20 AP for 1300 gold. This and this. Oh, well, let's go back to base then. Lovely. This guy's just pushing out my side waves. Kind of blows, but hey, those are some juicy top lane camps, I'll be honest. And mid wave. Oh, just start just freezing. Okay, why not? Thank you. Thank you, goats. We're 120 subs, that's ridiculous, by the way. Thank you guys all for your extreme generosity. Okay. I mean, I kind of want to be both side right. Oh, you this dead, so I can push one more mid wave. I want to try and maximize my EXP income over anything. Well, level 16, the game changes, right? This guy has three items, though. It's tricky. There's a ward here. Alright, I hard beat this guy in 1v1. 
I think. Yeah, I should. Like, it should not even be contestable for her. As long as my Lilia stays alive, they shouldn't be able to do Nash. And I want to get level 16 through Sidewave. Maybe if I can get the tier 2 turret as well, that's 600 gold, right? Tier 2 turrets are the biggest gold income I can generate. 1.9k gold. This guy has no flesh. There's two people here. I really like cards are unknown right now. Okay, I'm going to go for my both side camps. I wanted to play for these camps, but I think it's just safer for me to play for this camp. I'm going to ping my level 16 here. Can I please? 416. I'm just going to beg. I'm begging on my knees. Usually you shouldn't beg, but hey. My work. If I gotta be selfish. Raven Soul, thank you for gifting Solo Krabos. Okay, like, can I click? Nice. Alright, now we're close to level 16. It's okay, Alois, I've done some of... No ticks, seek help. Okay, let's keep going. I need level 16. I need this shutdown too. I think this wave gives me level 16. Stir the dragon for them. Uh oh. Well. Yeah, okay. You just, where's my HP, by the way? I just recall, I guess. That's fun. Why I, why am I not like Riven with with Maul and I just press E and I lose no HP? I even got to sell D-Blade now. Even less HP. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Well, time to get Zonyas, I guess. I need to get Zonyas. It's good against Zed, I guess, as well. Yeah, I need to get Zonyas. Or Zonyas. We can one-shot this. I think Kale is trying to, like, uh, speak about the fact that we're gonna get 16 here. Juju Jet! We hit it! Now, how can lose? Okay, we might not auto win the game yet. I need this shutdown. Yeah, one Q puts me back to go to base, I guess. And the champion. Okay, we'll play by own, I guess. Yeah, I just one shots with me, Blade Room King. Lovely. Okay, and maybe we need level 36. Then we win. Yo, we got three kills, I guess. That's good. I need water. I'm gonna run. This is the only time I can get water. I'm not sweating. Yes, I am. Okay, let's go. Well, what can we do? Level 16 kill. This guy is full build. The rest is kind of useless, though. They use, like, all their flushes, too, I believe. See, I'm level 16, but I don't even think I'm that strong. Just because the card is so fat, and every time that guy presses ult, I just dead. I'm just gonna have to use his, my old reactive to his ult. I think that's the only solution. Until I have Zonyas. Oh, Zed filled everything. Shut down. Oh, GG. Well, how can I lose? I'm gonna ult. CBA going to one HP. This is a misfortune, Tarek. This is maybe not the best. I think he forgot about misfortune. I think he's from counting. Do I turn? Oh no, we don't turn. I 
I don't have a medium wave. Oh. I'm really boosted, aren't I? No, I'm faker. All right, let's let's not, let's not flip it, yeah. That was Cal Clay, by the way. I want to kite, and then I misclick five times. I still gotta learn to kite. All right, let's get this. Uh, I mean, apparently this ki this arena just is stronger than me. But my team cool also kind of sucks. I have nobody that can like peel for me, you know. Last games I had like a Braum or like this kind of shit. Morgana, if you just press W on that guy. And I also don't have TP, which makes it kind of hard to play the map. Well, we're close to. This guy's no flesh. Why are you picking a pink in the pit? Man, you have no flesh. This guy's no flesh as well. I'm gonna use my ult. But they're also gonna play for soul. They do dragon, we can do the dra or if they're gonna do Nash, we should do the dragon. Let them do Nash. Oh, they're gonna go for soul. Yeah, they're gonna go for it. Yeah. Smart by enemy team. They're playing it slow. They're not giving us the opportunity to trade. Okay. Um What can we even do? No, that's not the angle. I don't know how to play this team. Our comp uh, seems a little lackluster. Like, our rally has free reign against our comp, right? We have zero hard CC. And we can't perma card too. It's hard to play. What's my last item here, even? I genuinely don't know. Ooh, my last item be here. Let's talk to the council. Kale 1v9. Kale 1v9. What's this? What? What? Death gap? Okay. Got a boss. Take natural resources. Yeah, it's kind of too late for that when this guy is full built. Like, everybody is full built. I don't know. They have soul as well. I don't know. It's hard. This guy's one item. Two items. Two items. It's kind of me and Yonat have to carry this game. Alright, homies push my sideways too. No, Kel can definitely 1v9. This draft is just hard, and I also made plenty of mistakes. I mean, this is already gone. But look at our comp, right? Like, we have nothing to start the fight, really. I really has bot. Maybe this fight can work. Are they all flesh again? Okay, I'll shut up. Oh my days, it's just an unlucky game. It's the, the, today's just, just today's just hard game. I had Sonya's on two! I spent three, I'm a pig! What even happened? We were alive with five. How can we not do Nash? How can we not do Nash, by the way? We were at five. Lilia chased. All right, Lilia's the pig. Man. 
This guy flashed. I think this guy flashed. They gotta play Nash. We got good vision this time around for once. Maybe I could have actually been in range to ult him. Maybe. We'll never know. How can play? Kill it with EOE. No. Yeah, I don't know what to do, man. It's a tricky game, tricky game. Maybe some of them goes red buff? But they're all chasing for kills, okay? Getting the wave is at least good. They only have X amount of waves with Nash, right? So taking any mid waves from them is massive. They have no waves, what are they doing? They're being a little bit kluggy, I think, chat. Okay, my bad, my bad, my bad, I'm sorry. No red buff. You think it's a jungle gif? I'm not sure. I'm not an expert. Could be. happens I mean I didn't play the best game as well in one second Sucks. I mean, I play pretty bad. No, not that guy. Anything but that guy. At least that's not grief level one this time, and that would be fine. Well, flashing night again. Let's go. What happened to Fiora's and Masters? We hit Masters. Did you? Ah, okay. Chat. After this game, I'm gonna ban Aurelia. I played it twice. I won't play it again. Pisses off with that matchup. This guy's playing Flash, TP, and this guy's also playing Inspiration instead of Resolve. So it's a little difference here. Wait, look. It's uh, what's this sword called? It's a uh, Moonlight Great Sword from Dark Souls. True. Your depression maxing with this song, not wrong. Okay. It's all tap, so my cursor stays on my screen. Let's go. No piggy found. Only my early ward here, so I don't get level 3 ganked. As dead of favorite tier 1 boss. Thank you again Hello, for 120 subs today, by the way, everybody. That's crazy. Dish. I'm taking too many means there. I can't fight in that angle too long. Yeah, I'm strong on you, bitch. Okay, that's a better level one. I gotta be careful of a level 3 listening gank, right? So I can do a third wave crash, which is a neutralizing play here. So what happens after a third wave crash is the wave is just gonna bounce back into me. And I'm not gonna be able to contest it too much. I actually took a turtle shot. I'm a pig. One more minion for level 3, though. Does she know, chat? Does she know about level ups? 
Made it. Ooh. What do I put? Two points in E and Ignite. Two points of Q. Ah, I told it! Woof! Ah, oh, I need this to crash. I need to push as much as I can. Just to make it then. YTP, Alois, YTP. YTP, uh, right night, Alois, right night. Try to run. Ah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Mom, mom! Yeah, again, I don't have Ignite or TP. And Lee Sin is still gonna be topside, by the way. That guy's still topside. So I still can play the game, by the way. Yeah, I wonder why it plays like that, chat. Wonder why it plays like that, Kluge. Wonder why it plays like that, Kluge. Uh, Arela, don't be too good at the game, please. Oh, you're still here! You don't deserve a s like a f a kiss, a kiss on the cheeks, a kiss on the cheeks. Oh no, playing playing the worst matchup in the game. Plus, 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 full weeks. I it's like my my actually, I'm actually addicted to that. By the way, I'm actually addicted to that. There's no better feeling than this. You guys know what I mean? Well, bot and jungle is winning, so I uh, can win, I guess. Right, chat? Right, chat? He's out of mana. Oh, he's biscuits. Oh, my days. I didn't check the biscuit. No, I can't hold it. I have to let it crash. And she's recalling in the second bush. I can't cancel her recall either. I'm gonna do it anyways. <laughs> I hit her. Doing the same thing I did last game, chat. Canceling that biggest recall so I can actually play out this bounce. I get like 8 more seconds that way, right? It might seem insignificant, but it's massive. Apples and Guten, thank you for T1. Now I actually have enough tempo to push out this wave. Alright, usually I don't know whether we'll be back, but that one cancel, giving me 8 extra seconds, allows me to be in this position now. Yeah, I have no respect for this guy. Well, do I just ult to proxy? It's pretty base, no? Just proxying here for fun. Arena's coming. Mommy's coming. Please don't cancel me. Please let me recall. Please listen, don't show up. Thank you very much. Oh, he's still pushing it to me. Nice. <clears throat> Is this the same from is this the same young from last game? Because in my team he was kind of a little piggy, but in enemy team he's kind of only nine. Now that blows. I'm I'm playing one of the worst matchups in top lane and I'm playing weak sided. But at least enemy Zix is only 18 CS, right? Zix is also weak sided. See in this type of games chat, my job is to go even. If I'm even, I'm doing my job, right? Because I have been pretty much left hanging. Right, I can't really do much. I'm gonna hard push this wave. Because I'm assuming I already has recalled. 
So my job is to neutralize my wave states, make it bounce back into me so I'm never gankable, and... Yeah, I'm not, never really looking for kills, I'm looking to survive. Survival is my first priority. I kinda don't wanna die. <gasps> I used everything in the book, but you know, worth it. I got a 600 shot on. Hey, weak side gamer right here. I still, the fact that I'm even in CS, by the way, playing weak side whole laning phase against Lee Sin Kel. Lee Sin Aurelia, S Kel. Hey! Any Fall Medals enjoyers! That one cancel I've done to on Aurelia here when he was recalling the second push. Again. Although it seems extremely insignificant, is the only reason I'm actually able to lane this game. Literally, that one cancel changed the entire laning phase. Not even kidding. Not exaggerating with that. If I didn't cancel her once there, I wouldn't have been able to push out the bounce. And then, basically, I would have probably died. Wait, did I only mention fundamentals 1k times? That has to be fake news. I need to try and make her push the wave here, but it's tricky. If I read as smart, she never pushes here. So I need to get to 1700 gold and reset. 1.7k, right? I mean, I'm probably gonna die here. I'll be honest. Ah! Sorry, sorry, sorry. I shouldn't scream like that. This is kind of griefing as lead as lead. It's good. It's very good. Okay, she's setting up every mean now. Now I gotta be careful. She can do our king stuff here. I got hit. I have to flash her ult. Okay. Are we fine? Might still be dead. Okay, nice. Yeah, could have just recalled instead of doing this shit. Any <laughs> happens. Okay, I should just recalled and just got him one point seven k gold, but it's okay. We lost flash. We live at least. Well, we're still in a relatively decent position, considering how this early game went. 125 plating. Velvi, you are a pig. You know that, right? Thank you for the bits. I'll take that. I'll buy I'll buy a McDonald's burger with that. Thank you. Open happy. Okay, bro, thank you for the 125. Are we coming, Rengar, or...? We have to take over the job here. We have to collect the wave. She doesn't have Borg yet, so I am stronger. I have full Mythic, right? Are you not paying attention? It's a little bit disrespectful by you. I'm gonna wait again with my Q. That guy is good. Thank you! Thank you, Lichten Wang, for the Prime. There again, it's legit actually the same as last game. Don't auto-attack, actually use my Q first, and then set up the kill like that, right? If I auto-attack her, I would slow down. Massive. Got a flash too. This is mid. Does she have TP? She probably does, and then again, I'm gonna kite to bot side here. Oh, it's like actually deja vu from last game. And last game, it was also just before she had Blade Run King. It's actually full deja vu. Exactly this happened last game. What the hell? Actually, like the exact thing happened. On her Blade Rune King spike. I hugged the wall. She couldn't jump at me. She's fuming, raging, seething, angry. But other argue the same thing happened. Actually crazy. What are the odds? Same matchup. Just before... Um, same matchup, right? And just before her Blade Rune King spike, she dies like that. Also with the Q into E, and then her TPing and finishing Blade Rune King. Actually, legit same scenarios.
Sounds good, everything main. Okay, but chat. I'm reading chat. Alright, thank you everything main for baiting Aurelia. I was just reading chat, but hey, I'll take those. La, 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 level 11 has been reached. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going now. Let's go, Lissandra. Killing that little mid king piggy. My ears? Sorry. I can sing some more songs if you'd like. Watch what happens when I hit level 16. Weak side kill gaming. Chad, did you learn something new in this game? Type 1 if you learned something new in this game. Like, you have to have learned something new in this game. I'm playing arguably the hardest matchup on weak side. Like, it, it's like playing League of Legends in hard mode, you know? Weak side in your worst matchup. Yet, I'm ahead. How did I do it? Fried Manus! Fried Manus! GG. Reset timers, wave replacement, jungle interaction. That's all I did. And then, we stabilized. Bear 94, push that way for me. I learned to not pick Kale. Based. My man, how is it? See, boss. Gotta help the bro out. There's a lot of homies here. This guy hasn't wrinkled in a while. So my bot lane was, was strong set this whole game, right? Why is my bot lane somehow still completely useless? I don't know. I guess Lee Sin has been getting them for a while. I've just seen Lee Sin top set them well, so that would make sense. I already have no flush. I have no ult, but I'm not scared. Did I really just AFK? Did she? I haven't seen her anymore. Is she actually AFK? That's crazy. She was strong sided in the war best matchup for her and she just went AFK. That is actually crazy. This Lee Sin build is so based. That build is crazy. Can I dive him? I mean, I probably can, but I just don't know how to approach it. Sorry. That's a pretty fat shutdown. That's an even fatter shutdown though. Let's go. Let's go, boss. Yeah, I really actually want FK. That's crazy. We just made him go FK. GG. We made that guy go AFK. Imagine getting your best matchup and strong sided. But then going AFK. It's like he got humbled too hard. It, it was too much for him to handle. And I, I don't know what he means. Right, that I should play that well. Herald is spawning, that gives me 200 gold. Then I can use that Herald to get tier 2 turret, which gives me 600 gold. So we're gonna expand our lead here through natural resources. What are natural resources? Sidewaves, jungle camps, Heralds, turrets. So, means are like coal, jungle camps is like iron. Herald would be like emerald, you know, and then like tier two turrets, bro. Those those are diamonds. Those are diamonds. Those give six hundred gold. Scuttle crab. This one is a gem. This one is gold. Where are you? You left me just like my dad. Okay, so yeah, that's your natural resource on the map. Two hundred gold here. Oh, shit, I was talking about Minecraft natural resources. Get it lasted. 
Now that gives me 200 gold usually, but I stole some of my gold, little piggies. And now this will give me 600 gold. Three people mid. Yon here. I really AFK. <laughs> Alright, so we can get the tier 2 turret here. Arguably even without using Herald. And if we do that, then we can just get this tier 2. Oh, I'm gonna take it anyways with Herald. I'm gonna speed up the game. Uh, a whole enemy squad is gonna come for me. Guaranteed when I do this. Ringer is gonna defend me though. Alright, chat, we're gonna brawl out. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. Come for me. I ain't scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, hello, Mr. Brent. Act as if I don't know he's there. I should have dodged a little bit more. Please. Oh, okay, chill. I'm gonna have to get used to dodge. Like, the thing is, there's too many things for me to get used to playing range champions. I barely play range champions in my life. Oh, not by the way. Like, the only range champion that plays, like, Jays. And I need to get used to, like, um... Kiting, but also sidestepping, being ranged. It's trickier, of course, right? But you died. What? <coughs> but your Jace is so good. It is. I know. It is. My Jace is amazing. Amazing. Yo, Smog, I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Yo, Silica, welcome. <laughs> Velvet, do you just like throwing bits at me, but then flaming me? Is that like your is that like your thing? Yeah, it is your thing. Thank you for the hundred dollars. Appreciate it, boss. I appreciate you. Nonetheless, even though you're a piggy. Can you can you like oink for me? Squeal for me? Do your proud squeal. <laughs> Okay, Ranger's bunny hopping. Playing Counter Strike 2. I need 1.5 or 105. Yeah, that makes sense. Great from Chile. Welcome, Chile boss. I don't know where that's located. Is that. Chile. That's like. South America, right? No, no. North, East. South? I don't know. Somewhere on the map. I'm European. That's all I know. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the 100 oinkers. My goat. South America? Okay, I'm actually right. GG. I didn't embarrass myself. Alright, Ziggs, go for the wave. You know you want to. Sucks. Chat, one more level. It's actually hard to not have 10 assists per minute on Kale, though. If you play this champion, it's unironically hard to not have 10 assists per minute. I don't know what you're doing if you don't have 10 assists per minute on this champion. It's arguably one of the easiest champions to do it with. Like, I see that kind of shit laning phase, but holy moly, you one shot everything on the map, by the way. Like, it's hard to not have this. In Emerald, okay, yeah, okay, fair enough. See, 90% of players are Emerald or below. So there you go. Alright, come here, Ziggy boy. Use your W. You wanna size at that? Okay, I did no damage. Buff kill. What's your window on Fiora? Gonna 80%-ish? Where's Brent? There he is. Alright, he's gonna ult me. <gasps> Goodbye. Time to go back to base. Come on, little piggy. I got level 16. That's a level 16 power spike you get. GG. Alright, I guess solo Nash now. This Ezreal, Fear Nash it was, not anymore. They. Okay, yeah, well. This Ezreal's macro is crazy good. Get Kill Lee Sin, then it's free Nash. I'm just gonna solo bolo it. 
Look at the range. Ezreal, you picked that Lee Sin. Good job, Ezreal. Both me and Senna are... Oh. Someone needs to tank the Nash for me, so I did one damage. Nice. Dude, this abilities actually kind of look like Moonlight Greatsword, though. If you know what the Moonlight Greatsword thing does when you're at level 16 Cal, your auto attacks high key kind of look like Moonlight Greatsword. Do you guys agree or disagree? It's true. Yeah, the weapon art, exactly. Would you buy Kraken Slayer? Because it's like the good, best starting item, probably. AP, AP kill kind of sucks. Kind of crazy that I made Aurelia a rage quit. Dish. <laughs> okay, who else? One more stack. Dish, dish, dish. Well, I'll play that guy. I play myself too. GG. Yeah, okay, we took Arena back. And uh, she went AFK. She couldn't deal with the, the pressure. I respect it. Let's go. Oh, we have, we have Morgana and Kale on the same team. GG, we have the sister lore, right? She's evil, disgusting little devil piggy. I'm Angel. Let's go. Clean. There we go. Now we can say clean. Any clears? AKA my gameplay. What fundamentals can I abuse with Syndra Mid? Level up timers, jungle tracking, reset timers, wave manipulation. <gasps> Plant spawn timers. I lost it bronze lore knowledge. Oh, my bad that I don't sit back in my chair and watch League of Legends lore. That is going to expand my horizon. <gasps> League of Legends lore. Kale is a piggy. Morgana is a piggy. Sejuani is a literal pig. Who cares about League of Legends lore? Let's focus. I don't even know shit about Riven. I know that she's a fake, no fake Noxian. I want to get Hello pushed guys, in. Hello, Blade 6, thank you for the, the tier 1 gifter. Appreciate it, boss. Why am I getting priority to Jax? Oh! This melee meme will give me level 2 chat. Jax might not know about it. Yo, Tavish. I'm getting priority to a Jax as a kill, by the way, because he's not playing aggressive. He hasn't used E yet. So in a matchup where I theoretically should not be getting priority, I have full priority. Now this can be two things. I'm either going to get level 3 gank by Lee Sin, or I'm going to do a third wave crash. Alois, why are you doing third wave crash? Because it neutralizes the lane. So in matchups where I just want to look to scale, if I get the priority in the early game, I am going to play to crash it at wave number 3. And this will neutralize it. Uh, can I last it like a human being? Yes, sir. Okay, second game in a row, chat. We're playing against a melee bruiser matchup in theoretical bad for me. However, both against Seth and against Jax, theoretical losing matchups, I have gotten priority. Against both matchups, I'm doing a third wave crash. And now, I'm going to make this wave bounce back into me. I want to hold these minions here to try and make my minions walk into turret range. Unfortunately, I took me an aggro, and I kind of helped him have my... Oh, my jungle's getting invaded. I can move here. You know why I can move, Jet? Because this wave is pushing into me. So, even if the skirmish goes horribly wrong, the wave will at least still be pushing into me. Syndra's moving, though. Syndra's level 4. Oriana's not moving. Piggy, I'm thinking you're dead, buddy. All right. Yeah. Ah! 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 But look at the wave though. Look at like the wave is pushing into me, right? But unfortunately, Jax gets a kill. Oh, don't tell me you get a second one. So Jax unfortunately does get a kill, but he lost two full waves here. So before moving here, I knew my play was at least half decent. But apparently, there's a level two Lux, and uh, yeah, just a little bit of team gap. But that happens. But in terms of where 
for Meush. They were good here. But of course, Jax gets the first blood. That's just my luck. They got SKT in Prime. They have Ward Finalist team. In, and you know, they have Keria, level 2 luck support roam. I've got Master MSB, Sejuani Jungle, being a piggy. All good though. Jumped over my Q. Madman. Okay, I did it. Now what? Bitch. I'm gonna try and cancel his base, by the way, because I'm an annoying piggy. Oh, okay. I canceled his base, chat. You see how I did that? Poor Mouse. Kitty. Uh, it just doesn't recall, okay? Like, that is his timer to recall. You know why it's his timer to recall, chat? Because if he doesn't recall right now, when is he going to recall? I'm gonna slow push the wave into him. And by slow pushing wave into him, I mean, he's not really going to be able to punish me. Imagine he just recalled and TP'd back, and he had a Sheen and a Longsword here, right? How would I be able to play the lane? Instead, he just stayed. So now I can farm for free because he hasn't recalled yet. This guy doesn't know about the reset time. This guy doesn't know about reset time, shit. Imagine he was, like, he had Sheen Longsword there. I guess he doesn't need because he's a piggy Jax player. Come, Jax, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me, Jax. Okay, I'm gonna recall. Too much. Too far. Please push the wave, Jax. Please push the wave. Alright, nice. This Jax doesn't know that this wave is pushing towards him. And if the wave pushes towards him, he's just allowed to reset. This guy doesn't know wave manipulation. And this guy doesn't know about reset timers. If this guy had played better with his waves and with his reset timers, I would be forced to walk up for assets right here. Instead, I'm able to play for complete free. In the happy spot. I'm gonna cancel this guy's base because I do have. Well, man. So I'm cancel him. Hey, where is he? Holy shit. Why did he recall there? He's a genius. I didn't expect that. I'll be honest. But. <coughs> okay, we got the skill to level 6 for free and look where the wave is at. The happy spot. Happy spot is good. Try to play in the happy spot when you kill. Okay, there's no potions. He bought pink ward instead of potions, but he does have priority, so he can get access to the river first. Okay, don't be too good at the game, Jax. Should have killed him away earlier. What am I doing? Okay. Definitely gonna have the potion. Yeah, he's going for the plant and river, right? He's doing some good fundamental tricks here. I'll be honest. This guy's cooking. I'm gonna get level 7 first here. He has no potions left though. So now if I go for some trades and I make sure I get ahead in terms of HP, I'm gonna play from a level 7 here and then I can trade, right? Now I'm fine with trading. There's no more potions left. I flee to sustain. I'm gonna sustain for my W. My bone pen is coming back up, right? We're seeing the bone pen is coming back up. I'm gonna ult here to block most of the damage. I don't just eat damage and it's all damage, so that's why I can win the fight. All right, you don't have to use your ult as like Trinomary ult, you can use it early during the fight too. Thank you, Piggy, for just following my wave. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you, Sejuani. Well, then do something about it. This soon as bot. Get him, Piggy. Just coming. Yeah. Cool. Have no mana. As Freak would say. Oh, never mind. Freak is the guy without mana. Please don't cancel me, please. Crack first, as always. Yo, potent! My man! How you doing, boss? I finished the Fiona challenge, but I played pretty much Conqueror only, and I played too, a little bit further into Masses too. I had a blast. Tonight, we're uploading the session with, uh, with you, potent. I'm uploading the session tonight on YouTube. Thank you once again for the amazing time. Oh, this guy doesn't know about his recent time, yet. He's still lurking. 
So it's going to allow me to play at the bouncer free again. Alright. I'm gonna hard push this wave because Jax lurked. Should have recalled. We had the chance. I always put full points in Q so I can do auto attack on each and then just one shot the right. But I don't have Noom Quiver yet, so my auto attacks don't do enough damage yet. I got to reset to get Noom Quiver. I think I will. Noom Quiver is such a big spike for kill. And now the wave will push back into me again. I shouldn't recall in, like, in turret range, right? He sees me recalling now. I know exactly what I've done, but it's okay. I'm not gonna buy potions. I'm not gonna buy pink ward. I just wanna scale. GG. The best piggy. You're gonna be playing on main after Riven buffs? Yes. I'll do, um... I'll do an unranked to challenger, probably. Full, full grind in one week, probably. I haven't played Hyelo now. Wow, now. Alright, let's hold this wave here. He has no potions, and neither do I. I have my ult in 15. I'm playing in the happy spot, right? We're very happy here. Look at my smile. Alright, we're gonna hold this wave here. I got flesh, I got ult, I got bone pointing, I got... For a man who splice mechanics, and now we're chilling. Uh, he could be roaming, though. Yeah, he's roaming. But it's okay for him to roam, because the wave is pushing towards me, so... If he roams, he's on the timer, right? He's losing CS and resources whilst he roams. Jax hates playing against the happy spot because he has no ranged form of wave clear, right? So as long as I hold the wave here, Jax is going to be permanently forced to walk up for last hits and he absolutely hates his life here. Because whilst he's forced up to walk up for last hits, I can perma trade. And he's not allowed to use his abilities aggressive onto me because I'm close to my turret and I can run him down the entire lane. So now, Jax pretty much asks himself, how can play, right? At this point, he can't. Happy spot enjoyers. Oh, jungle caps too. Oh, okay. What? What? Did they? Did they, they, they emerald? How is he in second emerald? By the way, that, that's how you deal with happy spot. That's how I can play. That's how I can play. I guess. That's how I can play. I guess. Sucks, bro. <laughs> Sucks. Sucks. Yeah, bro, he gets two plates. Don't be too good, Jax. <laughs> Kidding. We'll play Belly soon. Why is he walking back? What are you gonna do? Why don't you just know how to reset Hotshot GM? You have no mana. Do I kill him? He has no mana. Is that Eland? Of course not. He's no mana though. I need to space with him. The Q. Oh, that's flash at least. It's okay, I'll take it. This guy just doesn't know when to reset. That's his biggest flaw. It's also the hardest fundamental to master. Very often, for example, when I still land against changer players, I can very often still get ahead simply because they don't know how to reset uh, appropriately. Reset timers is the hardest one to master since it's the most situational one. And it kind of makes everything. Oh, does he have divine? Chat, we have a problem. We have a massive issue. We got a ginormous problem. House on fire. Jax has the wholesome item. Not even the happy spot can save us now. Not even Mama's hugs can save us anymore. It's GG. Yo, rival. I will do my Riven climb soon. Probably when I'm back from visiting my family. So, December 1st, I'm gonna go to Hungary. To visit family, and then when I'm back, I can uh, do full Riven grind, or maybe I do a little bit before. I'm not sure. When when are the Riven buffs coming through? Is it tomorrow? No, it's already Wednesday. So next week the Riven buffs will come. I'm trying to turn out the wave. Maybe we can keep the wave in happy spot a little bit. I need 1.4k for my item. I'm getting rid really too close. Cancel my auto. I hate my life. Kidding. I love it. Life is worth a thing. The only advantage I have is that I have tier 2 boots. He has no boots. So I can space him a little bit like that. I'm close to level 11. I gotta slow push this wave to allow this wave to walk a little bit further in lane. That's why I'm only last hitting latest frames to just allow this wave to walk a little bit further. 
If I push this fast, it's gonna be way deeper in the lane. It's gonna be way harder for me to play. Now it's still like relatively close. Nah, it's still completely doomed. I can play. Just get rid of the melees and then I can play, I guess. Jack should jump on me here. And he's looking for it. I jump on both sides, so I can't really play the game. I'm gonna just queue this. I'm gonna try and pace with him. I have tier 2 boots, right? I still can't do more than that. Alright, we're close to Mythic now at least. He just sustains from fighting me, he one-shots me. I'm gonna play left side here. Just a very slow game for your boy here. That's okay. Kill has that late game insurance. Level 11! We have transcended! I'm gonna fight this bitch. Dish. I'm not scared. You're scared. I keep my passive stacks up. 3, 4, 5. Not sure if I kill him there. And now it's a back off angle. There's a Lux behind. Oh my days. Of course it's a Syndra. Love it. Goodbye, bitches. Oops. I actually live. That's crazy. I did not expect to live. Now that's wonderful news for your boy. The top lane. Mm, give me this bitch. I'm gonna get blue trinket here. See, the thing is, I'm 0 KP this game. Like, if I was Riven in this position, I'd hate my life. But let's kill. I'm completely fine as long as I just have farm, you know? Because I have that late game insurance. Okay, he has tier 2 boots now. Now it's gonna be tricky for me to play. But the nice thing I have this game is I have a kill. Or sorry, I have a, I have a Morgana and a Sejuani to play with. Shut down. Bitch. First kill participation, 60 minutes in the game. Yo, Megadar, I appreciate that those kinds of words, brother. Appreciate it, man. I, I just see this. <laughs> yeah, boy. I'm still get the farm. Oh, time to run, by the way. That guy fists us still. Okay, but here's a recall. Lysid is back on the map again. I'm going to push out this wave. Is this side of pushing to us or away from us? It's natural. Neutral. Natural. I think I can't really progress here. Although this guy stayed, but I think he's close to be. And I'm scared of Lysid coming to us because of Herald. So I think I should go bot lane here. Because I don't want to meet this Lysid in the top lane. Jin flashed. I think I should just go bot. And, uh, but now nobody can go top. Yeah, I mean, now I can't have my decision is bad, I guess. But I'm assuming Lee Sin is mid, but my teammate's dying makes the game really hard to play now. And now this guy just gets the top tier 1 tier for free. Nah, I probably made a bad decision, but you see, they're all top side. That's why I want to be bot side, because I'm scared of getting dove here too. Yeah, I mean, Jax gets a turret. It sucks. Probably made the wrong decision here. That's okay. Maybe I can get some tempo. Get damage in a tier 2 turret. Get our both side camps, because Lucian hasn't been here for a while. Jax is still here. Ah, okay, uh, Jin is here. Lovely. We'll play with our both side camps. If I get this, I'm happy. I'm not gonna get this, am I? He's just gonna W and swipe it. I don't wanna leash her. <laughs> She's just gonna swipe it, bro. What can I do about it? Taking but oh, she has two full items too. That is not good. Oh.
Wow, she's really angry. I'm really getting targeted. This game is hard to play. I know this guy's no flesh, but I should play with my team. Even that is hard. I don't have the tier 1 mid anymore. They still have Herald. Amazing. Where's my Oriana? How can I play this game, man? It's a really, really, really tough game to play. I'm gonna play for Dragon. Syndra's here. She's no flash. Well, I can go for this bit way for Syndra's there because she's two full items, so it's just hard to play. It's just hard to play. Oh, this game is hard, man. All I have to do is keep high EXP, right? So I'm trying to maneuver myself around the map where I can get high resources. The side move is pushing away from us though, which kind of sucks. Maybe we can get this tier 1. Depends on where the Jax is gonna go. At least in his blight. The reason I want Aloys to say Wheaton, is because Prime. Small, Please Jax, don't be here. I just missed space really hard. Right, I'm gonna go take all three of these, of these camps. I just need to get to level 16 ASAP. It's a Sejuani. She does not need camps, I do. Right, Sejuani does not need camps anymore to get in this game. I need to get money. And as much as I can too. I'm gonna pick the 200 gold here. So Sejuani doesn't feel bad about me taking her camps, but she shouldn't. This guy has half a brain. That's why I really love playing with Sejuani, because it's a selfless jungler. I can take the resources. Theoretically, without him becoming piggy. Thank you so much for the Prime, boss. Right, we're gonna have two items now, at least. And we're level 14. Like, we are scaling, but it's only sideways in CS. That's all I've been able to do, right? I salute the bros. Oof! Oof! Sorry. Uh, Syndra has no flash. Player. Bro, this guy's emerald. That guy's not an emerald player. I refuse to believe that that guy is an emerald player. Thank you, package for the tier one. What is what else is he saying? Nah, those are not emerald mechanics, by the way. That guy's done it twice to me now this game. That is not his first rodeo. How can play? I can maybe TP top here and get this turret, but this guy's TP and this guy's TP. It's hard. What streamer would I recommend for jungle fundamentals? Zenarius. S I N. Zenarius. Can somebody type it for me, please? I'm gonna go mid first. I'm gonna keep my TP. I just have to. I just have to scale in this game chat, but it's really hard. It's really hard. They're all stronger, and I mean, I've been farming fine against Jax one v one, right? But Jax got a first blood level three, and he was just always a little bit stronger than me because of that, and it's just been a hard game to play. This side wave is gone, but this guy is pushing towards me, I guess. I don't know, it's hard to play. I need to get level 16, right? I'm trying to get that. Why are you XDing me, you piggy? I don't care. Okay. I don't care about you either. Why would you want to win? Axel Nagi, thank you for your prime. Today we talked to the most 
calculating and one of the most consistent rhythm players in the entire world. What do you think of Broxa? See, Broxa might have hit. Oh my days. I don't like this guy. Well, that's not the least income I'm used to. I'm dead again, aren't I? Okay. What do you think of Broxa? See, that guy might have hit world champion in League of Legends. But did he did he get rank one playing Masti this season? No. So that's why you watch an areas over Broxa. True. I, I can't get natural resources in this game chat. I haven't gotten a single kill. I'm barely able to get sideways or jungle camps or, or, or tier ones. Like, I haven't hit a single turret this entire game. I'm just not allowed to. Because everyone, like, Syndra is stronger, Jax gets perma hovered, and Jax is stronger in sideline too. I'm just too weak this game. It's so hard to play. Okay, I'm just gonna go for the tier one turret. They're all fighting here. I'm, I'm not gonna fight. They can fight as long as they want. I should get resources. Nice! I made a good decision here, I believe. I might die for it, but hey. If they keep fighting, I'll get two turrets. I can finally get some resource for myself here. Alright, look how fast I make my decision. They're fighting. The odds of me being in that fight and getting something, I can't say. I couldn't say, right? But now I at least got something for sure. My Caitlyn is a pig. True. Guys, full build. Oh, yeah, nice hitbox. Psst. Ah, what an annoying ass game, man. Annoying ass game. What kind of shit? Yeah, I don't know. Hard game. That, that is. Some Kel games are just gonna go like this. If you get. Like. Jax got the first blood level 3, I got Dove once, like, I'm playing fine against the Jax, in fact, I'm ahead, even though it's 3 and 2 and 6, he has 9 kill participation, I'm almost a full item ahead, but all 4 of these players are stronger than my 4 players, right? And I can't really control the game, every side that I go to, Dissandra does a, a wholesome combo on my ass, uh, if I walk to teamfight, listen, insects me like he's challenger and I just can't play, it's all good. I've done my very best. The sideways is at least pushing back into us, so I'm able to farm this and get level 16. Then if I get to 4 items, maybe we can skill into this game, right? It would be very, very, very nice. <laughs> That's fine, my Sejuani needs to blow with that actually. I, I know what he means. It's okay. This would be amazing if I can get a kill. Okay, please let me get XP. Oh, they're all gonna come again. I don't get time to play in this game. The three items here. I gotta thin this out fast. All right. When we killed Syndra, we got something. We got three items now at least. That's not enough. Thank you, Martin Gornick. Thank you, everybody. Sweet 16 party. Congrats on becoming a woman. Woman. Women? No, I'm good. My stomach is hungry, though. I need some food. Why not IEBT? Because they're not squishy. I couldn't be able to fight them. I need AP this game. <laughs> yeah, it's really criminal actually that she didn't have a bounty there. I agree, Krausu. I didn't want to mention it, but I agree. She had like so much, she has so much gold here. Like, but it's whatever. It is what it is. I mean, 240 is how much time we have to farm for something. I think I need to get Zonyas this game, actually. Against Syndra, Old, Jax, Lee Sin. I should get Zonyas. That's probably the strongest item I can get before this dragon. I, I need anything that spikes me temporarily. My guy is actually pretty strong here.
I could have ulted her, I guess. I forgot. Look at that Lee Sin, the whole game. Seen do that combo repeatedly, man. Hello, Jungler, by the way. I mean, they can't do much, right? I can play for the top tier too, fast. Can we play for this? It's a risk. Maybe Lux will walk into me. I'm gonna try and play for this. I'll probably force a TP out. I don't think I can actually play for it. Alright, who's going to be? Who's going to be the piggy? I actually get it? Soon as coming. Four items. Yeah, bro. Oh, it's, it's lovely. It's wholesome. I want to try and move on to Syndra. She will not expect me to be aggressive here. I missed. Okay! We can play for National Soul now. Or Deny the Soul, rather. Uh oh. Mama. Mama! He's coming! This guy's coming too. Oh, I have mana. Get him! Get him, boys! I'm down to do this. Or. Or dragon? I don't know. It's so flip now, huh? Can we do this? It's full flip. It's so flip. Let's let's dip. Let's go for dragon, huh? What? You're smart. Plus 1k, thank you. Any carry main? Any carry main! Nice trap hitbox. Nice brain. Chat! We're doing some things! We're scaling! Okay, little spit, little drooling. I have no mana. Mana. Me. Oriana, don't take it! Hey, brain, you got going on there. Maybe I didn't have to. What's that movie called? You know, like the one where uh, it's like about the, the bomb in Japan? It's kind of what happened there, I think. Yeah. No, that was awesome. That was nice, I guess. Ah, oh, that was nice. Don't nurse in your Oriana. They're fine. Yeah, Oppenheimer. GG, Oppenheimer there. We got Oppenheimer. Well, Valvi, not the time, not the time, Valvi. We're about to deny soul. We are at a good point. Think for the pits, though. Yeah, I don't know. Why did I ever use ultimate on Caitlyn? I guess my ult was pretty bad timing too, but yeah, I don't know. But we definitely need Zonyas. They're gonna get soul and Baron. That is not good. I have four items at least. I have to get Zonyas. Wits End is not going to save me, bro. If I get Wits End, she'll still. One combo me. That W is also like true damage now. I'm scared of Syndra. I don't know where Syndra's at. Oh my. Hey, pig? Yeah, we shouldn't play like this. Oh, yes, I should. Come here! Oh, my days. German music. Dang right. Get him, boys. Hold this guy. Oh, mama mia, that's a Sundra. That guy's scary. Haha! 
Mark shield, bitch! Okay, kidding, 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 kidding. Save me. What, 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 like, what's the skill in that? What's... Okay, just go next, I guess. They got Syndra, we got Ori. This guy's casting in one trick. They got Night Light, on Syndra. One shooting everybody in their mother. Watch this. Try to revive challenge. The Syndra is dodging those Oriana Qs a bit sussy, I'll be honest. Those Syndra, those, those Syndra dodge on the Oriana Qs were a little bit sussy, by the way. I know, we had a point to come back, but... We had a moment to maybe get back in the game, but not before that. If you want scaling top, what about Syndra top? <laughs> yeah. Alright, I want I want to continue watching what Freak had to say about Riven. Uh, thus far, he's legit been 100% on point. Now, I'm gonna make a disclaimer. People are saying it's it's loud. It's not loud, okay? Or so, so it's it, it's like not loud enough. Kale won't be a good pick here. All right, let's lose then. <laughs> Honestly. I'm sorry that I have put you in this position of no priority through top. However, your bot lane has prio and you can play through them. And I will scale and will be happy together. Let's go, brother. Playing as Yasuo, that's a problem, isn't it? Oh, good. We're gonna play happy spot. I apologize in advance as I will lose priority in the early game. So path to bot. My dearest jungler. Every outplay I do, I need to see holy emotes. If you guys use the holy emote when I get outplayed, I will perma ban all of you. Uh, I shouldn't say that, by the way. My dearest opponent, please push the wave. You need to push. Please. Thank you. I need to stand here so Yasuo cues me and the means. Thank you. Cue me and the means, please, Yasuo. Good job, Yasuo. Good job, Yasuo. Stop! Go back to mid. This matchup is severely unplayable. <laughs> Why does he see so many holies in chat? Yasuo doing third wave crash into proxy wave number four. Holy! Alois when he gets CS lead in the early game against Yasuo. Holy! Wrap yes. this me in. Now this one. Now this one. CS lead chat. See, let, let's, he's just proxying. What the hell is this guy doing? Are, are, are you okay, Yasuo? I think this guy's watched one too many Bows videos. Nah, Fizz, you're an idiot. Yeah. You're, a, you're an idiot, Fizz. That's like the only way he lives. I would solo kill him there, but Fizz wanted to kill, so he flashed and then he lived. Oh, this mean is gonna save me, look! This mean is gonna make the way bounce back into me. Frederick the Legend, look at this! He's going to keep these means frozen. I'll play. He he put Frederick into the turret. Holy! Please stop holding this video like like this, Fizz. You're ruining my wave. You're ruining it. You are ruining it. He's 4 CS. Fizz has 4 CS. Holy! Made sure I can't recall. Holy! Holy! What's my Fizz doing? Holy.
Holy! 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 Find the mantles. Thank you. Holy. Holy. Thank you for the three. Bye, Mavs. Holy. Holy. Oh, no. Holy. No. Two HP. Holy. Calculate. Holy. Where's the holies? I want to see 50 million holies. That was a pretty unholy play, I gotta be honest. GG. I got two solo kills as kill before my reset. And I got a clean crash. It's a little bit of a holy. It's a little bit of an unholy play. Oh, yes, I just went mid. He's had enough. <laughs> oh, yes, I had enough. Yeah, what? yeah it's time to go mid. <laughs> holy. Oh, vice movement. Holy. I can't. Holy. 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 I'll help you. Oh, you want to give this? Thank you. I don't know why he told me to take the Grom, but I'll, I'll take it. Like, I, he, he picked me to take it, right? Does this guy hate me now? I hope not. I did call it my dearest jungler a few times. He picked the Grom though. I think he allowed me to have it. Holy! Holy moly! Why do I have to land against this now? I was having fun against Yasuo, not the bird. Come on, man. Well, I guess the Fizz with 9 CS at minute 7. How do you even have 9 CS at minute 7? And Nivea has been top lane for like 5 years. How do you have 9 CS at minute 8? What the hell? He's 3 kills though. Pretty based. Oh, my movement. Holy moly. Stop blocking me. I need to proc her face rush. There we go. She has no face rush. Holy! 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 Please, dearest. Thank you. No, 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 no. Oh, good. I don't need you. Brody Martley, it's a cannon wave. Please don't take my XP. There's nobody here. Alright. Wow, you do Harold by yourself then. Holy. Jungle brain, just take my entire cannon wave XP. Why the hell not? <coughs> Kel, can I top against her? I need to stop saying this. I'm like a bot. I'm an NPC. What are you doing? Oh my days. This Anivia is crazy. Holy Anivia mechanics. Look at my mechanics here. He has no idea how to play against this movement. Unholy outplay. Get away. I'm the bigger bird, bitch. I'm that dog. I'm that dog bird. Sit down.
Fizz doesn't know how to communicate with Vi. He had to say, my dearest Vi, please come mid lane gank here. Who was that? Who was it? Who was it? I'm sorry for not being raised well. Kidding, my mom did a fantastic job. I'm just a pig. Oh, give me this play, please. New voice. Wait. Please don't cancel me. I'll kill you if you cancel me. Don't do it. I want you. My movement, holy! My movement, holy! Stop it! Holy! 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 Little bit of a spit. Yeah, I'm starting to get pretty decent on kill now, though. Chat. I'm starting to like understand my champion a little bit more, though. Told you I killed him. Champ is broken, man. Champ is broken. We're gonna wait in a second, right? Yeah. Alright, Zuko's playlist is popping, GG. Did... Chat, didn't Fizz have like 9 CS at like minute 7 or minute 8? How did he double it in 4 minutes? How does he only have 20 CS and 6 kills? Holy... But what, what is he actually doing? He just, he just like, you know, increases farm with 7 in like, I don't know, I don't know. He's a 500 shutdown. He's no farm actually. Right, holy. Okay, maybe I see you. You're a little too aggressive, that little bird. A little bitch bird. <coughs> if I was level 11, she would have died. True. Watch this AoE on the mean. Watch this AoE on the mean. Watch, watch, watch. Wait, I'm gonna level 11, I'm gonna A with him in. Oh, it almost hit her. It did, though. Oh, please. Imagine the AoE on the mean would have killed her. It would have been crazy. It would have been crazy. It would have been crazy. Oh, good, though. I'll slow push a little bit. Why? To let this means walk past the wave so I can farm that wave, too. I'm probably gonna die for it, but it's a good death. True. Or I'll play. We can say holy. Okay, chat, get ready. Don't say it, chat. That's not a good holy. He, like, she killed me because of smite and shit. Mods, do your job, please. Mods, stop working. Mods? Why is it fundamentals, too? Fuck off. Piss off, sorry. No cursing. I'm sorry. Let me go. Holy moly, fizz with another kill. In the pocket. Just like that. Rep of spawning. I'm hungry. In game IRL actually. I need some food here too, but it's fine. But just so it's 0 5 has a rep of though. Holy boy, that Q side up of him was kinda crazy. Holy! I'm just baiting him though. I want the red buff. Thank you. Uh, that's a bird. Holy. What's everything doing, man? Surely. This Jasu just got out holy and it's fact. Alright, let's go bot. I wanna kill Salia. I have an opportunity with this guy to schillen. You guys know what I mean? If you know, you know. I'm gonna help the Zyra out though. Team diff only. Here's the Roman kill. Holy. 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 Holy! 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 Restart two. Movement. Oh. 
Wait, what, what is unholy? What is this? <laughs> nice, you got unholy too, GG. This is... <laughs> uh, amazing. I love you, Twitch shit. Well done. We've got unholy now too, GG. No. <laughs> of course, there's an unholy too. <laughs> but the holy one is still so funny. Like, the unholy isn't that funny. The holy one is just too funny. It's true. By the way, Chad, this is a game where I actually shouldn't build this. I should go full crit. Because there are five squishies. I should go Infinity Edge and one-shot everybody. And, and then, like, when I kill them in two auto-attacks, we can spam holy. I have to go full crit this game. Holy! That was one auto. Holy! Remember when Vizet kill is weak? Yeah. I'm gonna ask him. My dearest jungler. My... Ah, uh, I gotta deal with this way. Oh shit, mama, mama, mama. Okay, good side. I didn't sidestep it, it's unholy combo. Ah! It's holy! Send out coming, maybe. Send out coming. I'm ready to ult. It was an unholy play. Anyways, my dearest jungler. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. Who wants to mess with me? I salute the, I salute the homies. Dude, there's only bangers. I just ult, just ult is like a, you know, it's like a guarantee, you know? It's like a guarantee. Like a little, little bit of a guarantee there. I need Infinity Edge, Chad. Once we have Infinity Edge, we gotta send 5 million holies. Sell this for base. Chad, we need Infinity Edge. Okay. Against full squishies, you get Infinity Edge. Hi, Darren Lois. I'm a YouTube watcher and I love your videos. Promise I'm a jungler and I was wondering is there a similar YouTube young man that can teach me as well as you do? Scenarios. Check out S Scenarios. Chad, can you type Scenarios to the homie? Zanaris is an absolutely amazing educational jungler. No, not scenarios. You piggy. Alright, chat, watch this unholy outplay. Hello! Holy! Plus 100. Holy! I get infinite edge. I shoot soon. I'm gonna do some unholy things to enemy teams in chat, I'll be honest. Wait, careful! We can't kill Yasuo one more time, he power spikes. One more kill on Yasuo and he actually power spikes, it's scary. He's gonna be 0 10 0. Chat, we got the holy item. Can I get some holies? Now we need level 16, and then we have full holy combo unlocked. I think I can already, like, let's do some holy combo to the Senna. I'm casually six levels up. Senna! Stealth. Oh. Alright, chat. That was unholy. My bad. <laughs> you pigs. <laughs> you piggies.
Okay. Just just exclamation mark fat in chat as well, also right, why not? Your mom's fat. Kidding. What is Yasuo cooking? I got the Grom though. Me. Bitter. Bitter. Me last hit, please. For level 16. For dearest. I said dearest. I said dearest. I said dearest. You disgusting pig. You disgust. Okay, I'm just gonna farm level 16. Okay, let's do some unholy things in top lane. Yasuo 0-10-0 zero zero though, we gotta be careful. We gotta remain... Holy! 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 Wait a sec! Level 16! Did we get it from Nash? Please? Bitte? Oh, no yet! Almost! Chat! We've hit the lonely... Holy moly smoly! Okay, let's do some things. I think I can also e that I want to survive crit. On a regular, by the way, I need some more crit. This guy has this, okay. Just fit my one to another guy's inventory, why not? Ooh. Actually, if she walls in vain ease, I kinda get stuck. Uh oh. This is not holy. I stunned to the Talia wall. I, that was one auto attack on the vein. Imagine I can actually auto attack. Bro, they're just creating fake walls. They're just creating fake walls for Vayne. How is that balanced? How is that fair, by the way? It's not. I agree. Thank you, Chad. Thank you for making me feel better. Well, that was anti uh, climactic. Get Storm Razor for the one shot. T times you're cooking. You're cooking. Yo, I like the Storm Razor. We go this into Storm Razor. Yo, that's cooking. That's cooking. T times. You're cooking. I need to one shot some people. I'm surprised MTV has an FF, I'll be honest. I respect it though. Who's here? Come fight me. The guy's pretty strong. I should get. Holy! I didn't crit. Else she would die. I only have forty percent. Holy! Ooh. Holy! Holy! What? Like I want to fight. Where's more people? Kinda boring. Stop being ranged. I'm permanently seed, man. Champion's boring. This champion has so much damage, but it's so easy to CC me too. Holy! Oh. I'm not critting either. I need more crit. No! Nah, I finally did something holy. Don't end. Please die. Yes! This guy's 0 14 0. <laughs> but now we need Storm Razor. Okay, we get some more crit, chat. We get some more crit. This guy's kind of smurfing it. 
What is this emote? <laughs> Dude, <laughs> who is inventing these? Oh, amazing. Nah, so many good emotes today. Good job, Chad. You guys are cooking. <laughs> Bot lane, holy. <laughs> oh, insane. Love it. Alright, chat. We got 75% crit. And mechanics. Let's go into the base. Okay, maybe not. I can get CC'd. Tally has four items. She can one-shot me. Holy! I'm stuck. Holy! I'm stuck. That's not funny. I wanted some kills. My bad. Whoa, this is shit damage! Oh, it's Lethality Jin with Man Immune. I guess it's ultimate just one shot speaking. Here goes the gas the get rag boy fizz. And yeah, now my team just ends the game. Uh oh, they have Gosu. We need Moly. What is this? <laughs> Bro! Ah, uh, we got Holy and Moly. GG. Holy Moly. GG. Unholy, holy moly. Unholy moly. GG. <laughs> that looks too troll, actually. Actually, cursed. Nah, this looks cursed. It kinda looks disgusting, bro. <laughs> nah, it looks so cursed, actually. It looks so cursed. So I don't know if it's Nasus top or, or Vladimir. We've got like the battle of the scaling. We've got like kill against Senna, Vladimir, Nasus. Kind of crazy. It's Nasus top. Uh oh. Chat, we're in, we're in trouble by the way. This matchup is not very good for me. I should have gotten Lethal Temp as well. Also, we have tried coaching Joe or AD Carry. Yes, I will. I'll play every role eventually. But right now, I'm just a guy that makes hamburgers, right? I'm just a guy that does top lane. I'm not gonna go transition into kebab or pizzas yet. Yo, Martin. What's up, dude? Found you on YouTube. This is my second stream. Good to see you, boss. Uh, this is what you do against Nasus. You buy Boots of Swiftness. Read this with me. The strength of movement slowing effects is reduced by 25%. Well, Nasus W pretty much cripples you, right? I don't like being crippled. That sounds so bad. Uh, but you get the point. Okay, it's E-start. Do I go Q and save him? Nah, I want E-start. Okay, we should. My, well, my jungle's game is kind of over, or my mid lane's game is kind of over. You got some vegan alternative? Nah, bro. No, homie just misses E. We're gonna wait for all six means to crash. Yeah, Sucks. Try to always hit fleet on your opponents instead of means. Why am I solo HP, by the way? He's playing Scorch as well. What a piggy. I see. Am I getting ganked? I'm getting ganked, aren't I? He plus 12 me as well. Oh my, this is so shit. You are a pig, and Viego's a pig as well. And I'm a pig too. Please, potion. I should have stayed for in the wave, play for my level 3. I give him plus 12 as well. This is so bad for me, chat. This matchup is already on like a timer for me. 
Like this happening in the early is like kind of a death sentence. He's already level three. Look at all the mains he's still going to collect here. He wants a plus 12 though. Yeah, but like he's already 33 stacks. I'm so doomed. We need to dive him here. But my jungler's not. My jungler's just clearing instead of diving here. I don't know. It's kind of BG for me here, I'll be honest. I don't know how I can recover from this deficit, I'll be very honest. It's gonna become really, really, really hard to play. What is items? Yeah, I got Shimmer fillable, man. Like, he can just basically farm for free and there's nothing I can do about it. Well, all I can do is just focus on last thing, I guess. It's Bell of the Scaling this game. I just not- oh, He missed again! We can win! Here we can win, chat. We can win. I've got a dopamine spike. I got a dopamine spike right there. Real quick. Uh-oh. He's angry now. Holy shit, he fists my head instantly as well. If he's already doing this now, it's not a good sight. Okay, I gotta start setting up my reset again, so I wanna start pushing back into him, getting my level 6. I pre pretty much can't deny him from farming his passive stacks, there's no denying that. And there's not even a point to poke him, like there's no point, he just out sustains. he's already too strong. He got too good of an early game. We do have decent CS at least. Alright, I wanna start pushing towards him. Yeah, let's push. All right, Harpish this. At least he allowed me to get this wave in. Oh. I mean, no, you're not gonna do that. Oh, no, you gotta do that. You gotta do that. I'm gonna ult here. Touch some of the damage. I'm gonna ult him for fleet. No, I actually have to flash. I didn't even see him switch to ghost. He just did that there. I misplayed. Really hard. Okay, at least he's pushing. I don't need to be full HP because he's going to reset anyways. Oh, Chad, I'm so screwed. If I had at least gotten my recall off there for free, it would have been good. Cancels recall a few times, so now he's annoyed at me. That's good. We're both annoying each other. There's a plant here, so I'm gonna hard push this wave. 
Maybe get a plate and then go for the plant. Yeah, this comp is pretty doomed to the Nasus. However, Caitlyn and Zyra can kind of still do shit against him. Okay. Look at his item shit. At least my farm is still decent, right? That's always my foundation to rely on, but... Blah, 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 blah. At least the wave is pushing into me again. And I can play out the bounce. I want Nasus to E here. I saw the wave pushes into me. E me and the means, please. Uh-oh. That's not what I said. Holy shit, I'm crippled for long. And I'm losing the cannon here. We can't spin! We can't! GG. How can I play? All I can do is just farm and hope for the best and play with uh, wave manipulation. All I need to do is not die again, right? That's what I'm trying to do. What are doing? This need good. Please don't get free kills. What are you doing? Well, at least Nasus used flesh, I believe. So that's something. But yeah, it's a kill again, and I, I, I lose my freeze. Lovely. I don't know. At least we got 5 AD from Gathering Storm. <laughs> Yay! I hate my life. Kidding. It's not true. I'm very thankful. I just hate this game. At the moment. Oh, he's gonna miss the cannon. Minus 12, bitch. Can you not farm on my means, Shaco? Appreciate that. I'm gonna switch my trinket, anyways. Uh, what mythic do I go? I don't know. I'm gonna go Kraken, anyways. I could be on the wave as well as his. I mean, we're still farming decent, I guess, right? I mean, just look at the scale. There's very little kills this game, so that's good, I guess. I actually do some damage now with my autos. Okay, kidding! KIDDING! I'm... I was actually joking. Okay, thank you. Woo! Wither! Wither, your mom! Okay, let's go. Focus. Well, that's the good thing about the skirmish that happened in the river. He lost his flash, right? So... Like I said, we can look for a kill there. Let's play for plates. We got Kraken Slayer. Does he have TP? He might. He's TPing behind me. I can bait him. Oh, he has Swiftness Boots now too. I'm baiting though. I'm, a I'm just acting as a bait here. Thank you, Shaco, for your surface. Can I get the full turret? That's pretty amazing. Okay, now we're back in the game chat.
Hmm. Uh, I definitely mispurchased. Should have gone this, this. My bad. That was a tricky one. Plus five. He still doesn't have the vine. Okay. Well, like, we're good in the game again. He didn't, doesn't have that many stacks. <laughs> My bad. Sorry, we'll level up. The guy's kind of smurfing it. I'm just hard push this wave. He has flesh, so I think I just push this. Shake is going bot side, I'm gonna take blue buff. He can't really freeze this, it will still bounce into me because it's a cannon wave. Vladimir's mid, let's push this now. Vladimir's bolt rather. You know, Shaco's gonna push. 50 for Herald. You should just hit this Talon. Come on, you're already too late. We're already too late. Ah, uh, Vegas here. Guy is strong. It's a thing what I mean, right? Even if we walk bolt, we're already too late. <laughs> Did you still have all their ults? <laughs> Poor Talon dies as well. Can I just walk past him? I want to play for this Herald. So I want to put him to a little bit lower HP. Nice. By putting him a little bit lower HP, I can play for the Herald without having a headache. Right, chat. We're doing the same. Oh, Zara has anti heal. I want this Viego shut down. <sighs> please, please, don't, no, 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 please, wait, 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 I die for it, but it's worth. It's so worth it. I missed my Q. I got Zoya too. Super worth it. Super worth it, chat. Now that's a good decision. That's a good. De that's a terrible decision. Oh, this guy's just freezing. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're chilling. All right. Nasus does nothing productive, and this wave is gonna slow push towards me. Chat, you know, similar to laning phase, this is not a neutral position, right? So his next side wave, this wave, will arrive faster to his side than my side waves come to this, right? So this side wave will actually bounce back into me. Even though it doesn't look like it, this side wave is bouncing into me. So this is extremely good. This side wave is neutral. So I can go bot first, and then later on I can catch the side wave that's going to realistically push into me here. Side wave management. Very important. You see how it's even here? But look. His mini wave arrived faster. So now the side wave is pushing towards me. So they have a bleeding side wave. Bleeding side wave. Oh, look. The side wave is also pushing towards us. We just out our NG'd. So both side waves are good for us. So it's extremely good for us economically. And now I just ping Talon to go here. I can't go there. I'm too late. I, don't, I forgot. I don't have TP. But let's say I had TP right here, right? Let's say I had TP. What I would do is I would push out this side wave right here. Push out this and then TP top collect both waves. Right now, it's reversed. Now this side wave is pushing away from me. Why? Because my minions are closer, so my minion wave will arrive faster. So I go top here. Why? Because if I don't, the side wave will slowly bounce away from me. And I don't want that to happen. I don't want the side wave to slow bounce away from me. It's bad for economy. Bad economic decision.
But I have Herald and I want to use it somewhere. Maybe mid. Yeah, I just go mid for Herald. I don't think I can play for the tier 2 turret, so I'm gonna use Herald mid. If I can get the shutdown too, even better. Even better. Oh! Mama! Mama! Sorry, I need to shut up. That's a lot of money. Good economic decision! Holy shit, I get everything. And now we go bolt for tier 2 with Herald. Oh, so please stop. I misclick. I misclick my path thing. Fleet? Nah, no, it's not enough. Bad, bad position decision. And he flashed and ghost. It's cringe. My bad. How's my relationship with my neighbors? I think it's fine. My family accepts me for who I am. A criminal. Well, chat, what's happening with the side wave? Kinda hard to judge because their means are a little bit lower. I think it's actually slow pushing towards them, this one, but I'm not sure. We'll find out. Well, Harold is kind of going away, unfortunately. But we're still pretty strong, right? Yeah, it's pushing away from us. Uh, 25 seconds. Okay, it is slow pushing towards me. Good. Going both here kind of sucks, you know why? Because we're gonna play for Dragon anyways. So everybody's gonna be here. I might as well just start it, I guess. Sucks died that I died to Vladimir. Also, I could have maybe played for the Botir 2 turret, but I had really aggressive pathing. Well, 14 out of 16, chat. Two more, two more holy levels to go. Uh oh. Can I face check this? Where's my team? Oh, I, think I just made a blunder. I think the boy just made a blunder. I just walked into a NASA TP. I was not paying attention. Well, we got the dragon, I guess. Okay, pink what just did now play too. My bad there. Uh, I can TP here maybe and play for the tier 2 turret though. Holy shit. Shaco boxes and the Zyra plants this team fight are crazy. Yo, LZS, welcome. I think I TP both here. Only Viego can come or Heimer. Heimer might want to go here. The side is pushing away from us, right? Heimer might come. I'm tipping anyways. Okay. I cancelled everything. Alright, send me to prison. No, take me. Take me, Viego. Take me. I want you to kill me. Okay, kidding. I live, I live, I live. Don't, just don't take any words from me. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's fine. Let's go. I know what you mean. Don't take any advice from me, you know? I'm 3 and 5 now. Why? I'm not wearing black. This is Bordeaux. It's like red. This is black. Look, wait. This is black. This ain't black, boss. Dark red. <clears throat> Don't sell it, you can buy. You're very correct. Okay, let's focus, chat. Let's focus. No more anything. No more anything. Kluge. Kluge. Well, we're still full item above the rest, I guess, even though this guy has 10 kills, because we got the natural resources. Natural resources. Why do I have to pee? Where are your turrets at, bitch? 
Watch my HP it. Gotta run before Kaden decides to get a rub off. I think I should be able to kill this Heimer though. Okay, here he called. Why is mid? Uh, I went sideline against anybody now. Um, actually, it's dark red. Alright. Cringe lords. Where did my plant go? Does it just disappear when the turret dies? Oh, I want this. Chad, we're gonna have to do a montage. Why the whole the whole squad is in base and shit? Nice montage on the side wave. Maybe somebody overstays and I can kill him. Okay, I'm trying to get level 16 then. Um, my bad. Made a lot of bad decisions this game, but. Luckily, in this MMR, everybody makes mistakes, so as long as I farm here, we'll still be fine. Fighting all here. I might just play for this. Little masses might come for my ass. That's no bueno. Okay, there's the ward. So he definitely knows where I'm at. He took that from me. Okay, there's no face rush. It's only one item, he's not that strong. I'm just scared of the Nasus. The reason I want Alois to say is because he's small and people take him seriously. Thank you so much for the prime. I have folks here though. We got both your two turrets now. I got two kills, so I'm gonna stay on the map. I gotta focus here a little bit because I grieved so much. Ah. He doesn't have Garden Angel there, no? Oh, he no, he doesn't. He had Garden Angel, but when he picks up Shaker, he doesn't get Garden Angel. <laughs> That's a little bit of a blunder, a little bit of a blunder by the boss. A bit of blunder by the Viego boss. Don't pick up Shaker when you have Garden Angel, bro. This guy said, I don't know, I'm just gonna spit in his face. He's not happy, is he? The battle of the scaling champions! He's like, I'm killed, bitch. Oh, Senna, you wanna skill? Oh, you're scaling champion, right? Dish. Go in your zonias. Oh, I got 5k tokens in the bank. Hey. Did I play good this game? No. Did I end my lane? Yes. Did I play int inside lane? Yes. But I do have 10 sis per minute because I'm playing good macro somewhat around resources. So I just farmed well. So I'm still always good in the game. GG. GG. Do I go Lich Ben? Sounds like a plan. You guys know who a good coach is? Uh, Ryla is not bitch man. That guy is good. Yo, brother. Yo, brother. Finally got back to D2 after your coaching. Let's go. 
kinda feels like I have to work twice as hard to win on Fiora as on any <laughs> other champ I play. Oh, okay. Am I just washed or what's the problem? Um... I think against some comps you'll have that feeling, but um, I don't think that's per se the case when playing Fiora. I play it her too. CP, thank you for the 7 months though. Thank you for the tier 1. Uh, I think against some comps I can see where you have that feeling. Uh, depending also if you play Grass or Conquer, right? Yeah, wait a second. Holy! My range. My E got cancelled though. Holy! Don't please cripple me. Battle scaling. Oh. Oh, he's mad! Chat is mad. He ghosted. He's ghosting! He's ghosting! Holy! I'm crippled! I can't auto attack for shit. Can I walk? Okay, thank you. Look at the side wave. <sighs> we just randomly won the game or what? I mean, I just randomly got level 16 and just won the game. Kind of. It's kind of crazy. Watch the Senna. Okay, kidding, kidding, kidding. Look at the sideways though. I can't press either. Oh sh I can't resist. I can't resist. I can't resist. I can't resist. I'm sorry. I'm, like my hand's shaking. I gotta get the sideways. Oh I had to. You guys know what I mean? No way you can avoid that, bro. Like, I don't mind kills, I just want to side with man. I need that. I can't. I can't let that slide. Alright, Fubu killed me in 13, let's go. We are flashing. Which one last hit it? Sorry. I'm such a pig, I know, but it's like dope, like it's... Temper, like it's a small dopamine spike. Tiny spike, but it helps. My team can start this, and I'm just gonna zone them away from it, by the way. I'm never gonna let them enter this. Okay, I got crippled. I'm in trouble. I can't auto attack. I'm stunned as well. You wanna fight me? <laughs> That's what I thought. Holy! Holy! Holy, holy! Let's send be like, yeah, guys. Guys, I'm saying 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 Right. That was a jungle gif. Now this game was decided by junglers. I'm gonna have to play around Bart ult, Bart Q's, Ash ult, Gragas ult, Oriana ult, uh, Graves W. How do I play against enemy comp? How do I play against this comp? They have like five different things to dislocate me with. I can't position anywhere. How do I position against enemy comp? On our play. Gragas ult, Oriana ball. Bart Q, Ash ult, Bart, like, they have, okay, let's let's say Bart ult, Gragas ult, Oriana ult, Graves W, Ash ult. It's like, all of them have one ability that I have to dodge, like, I have to dodge. Oh, Chad, we have the same brand from last game. We have the same brand and vein from last game, actually. All right, let's focus here. I'm going to try and get priority, even though, yeah, I, I can get priority, actually, I think. Because it's Gragas. Gragas isn't the best, like, both me and Gragas are really weak early game champions. So I'm just going to look for priority. I don't want to trade much with him. Okay, it's W start. Uh, also, I'm just gonna try and deny him from getting mana flow stacks onto me. Focus the melee to get my level 2 here. Okay, I've already lost 2 last hits for free. Amazing. What's happening in bot lane? I've been losing like so many last hits for free. For fun. But I'm not having fun. I lost three. Choo -choo. Yo, if somebody subs and 
actually can like, yeah it's kind of weird i mean i also can see follows do i do do we even see follows notification can somebody follow do i see follow notification still does it still show a notification on stream if somebody follows you don't have to sub anybody can follow yeah i don't see follow notification no i guess uh i guess stream labels has to work it's not working right now unfortunately to anybody who follows or subs or even donates, I cannot see it. I'm very sorry. Oh, wait, no. I can't see it. It just shows in chat. But I, do I just see it in chat. I don't see anything else. Thank you for the D1s. Worthless milkshake. And uh, Crime Skeleton. But I don't look... Like, I don't see anything on my stream. You don't see, like, uh, Yada 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 is following. Uh, yada 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 is the goat. Uh, this guy is a beast. All that stuff. The only reason I know that you subbed is because it shows in, in Twitch chat. That sucks. Yeah, there's no notification, nothing. Professional streamer, by the way. At least subs show in chat. He's getting a biscuit again, this fat guy. Of course he's running cookies. Be correct, good to see you, boss. Instantly in his cookie as well. Go on a diet. I should too. Emi, nice. Get baited, bitch. Now we die. Had to quickly snoop in the cannon, though. What are you doing? I guess he's Gorgos. I'm not gonna get level 6 exactly now from next wave because Nocturne took a little bit of my XP. He doesn't have enough mana to kill me. I think I need to buy boots and suits in this game, by the way. Graves W, Gragas Q, Ash W, Bart Q, Oriana W. Like, yeah, I need to boots and suits in this game. It's so good. There's so many slows. Normally, I'd level 6 exactly from this wave. He will get level 6 exactly, but I won't because Nocturne took some of my XP. But he doesn't have flesh. He gets level 6 here. On this, these two casters. Oh, then he lost the EXP while I was recalling. Then he needs it from one melee. Yeah. <whistles> Before you guys call me a fraud. Fraud. Yo, Eagle Blade. I will do uh, Rengar as well. Level 6. Finally we can play the game. Oh, the guy's coming top again. There's no flash at least, but I'm not going to take this way for 5 years. Oh, guy's going to take the snacks as well. This guy's biscuits. Please get the plant, get the plant, get the plant, get the plant. No? No, okay, they're going to give it. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, he didn't get the plant either. Imagine he takes biscuits and plants and whatever. Double snacking. A little bit of movement. A little bit of movement! A little bit of movement! I'm in his head. I'm in his head. Like, this guy is scared of me now, right? He fears me. He's not able to land a single ability on me. Oh. Yo, Aaron Timo! Good to see you, boss. He has no flesh, no old. If he kills the means, they're gonna push into me. Oh. 
I misclicked like three times. Okay, I misclicked like five times. Sometimes happens. Oh, thank you, Grace. Thank you. I mean, the wave will bounce, but it's okay. I misclicked like four times there. It's my bad. Wait, did I get executed? Wait, I got executed. Calculated, of course. Calculated, of course. That was calculated, by the way. Yeah, that was calculated. No biggie. Just, uh, look at this guy, he's yet to land in the queue onto me, you know? Like, how angry is this guy? I'm gonna, ooh. Now he's gonna focus them on the means. He's tired of trying to let them out. We, ooh, I was too late with the reacting. Can't dodge that one. Okay, I got too much ego now. He's dead. Oh, actually, I didn't expect him to have ult already. Why did I flash? Why did Nocturne ult? Wow! That is so fun! <laughs> wow! Wow! Imagine complaining about Kale, by the way. That's amazing. I don't know. It feels even better if there's like a second play about playing Kale, you know? Wow, that is so much fun! I can see why this champion is extremely infuriating to play against though. <laughs> that laugh is definitely like him laughing in game, but him I roll. <laughs> Loose quick. <laughs> How angry is he? Sorry for scripting, bro. <laughs> He's dead. Oh no, I just walked into a bait him. No, poor Gragas. <laughs> oh no. This guy is not having it. I know I'm s s champion starting to grow on me. Ooh, he's being behind me, Chad. I don't see it. I need crack. Oh, I have Kraken. Okay, let's recall. Is he gonna cancel me? He should. I don't even think I need to TP, to be fair. I don't know why I thought Gra Kraken was 2k. It's 1.7. Fuck that, Tommy. Chat, also, I want to say one more time. Um, stream labels isn't working on my stream labs. And as a result of that, I'm not able to see if you follow or donate or even sub. Actually, sub shows in chat, never mind. Yo, kill one v nine. Good to see you, boss. Yeah, you have eighty on E and Q, I guess. Don't ask me about mass in League of Legends, though. I just built items that are optimal, and I don't know why. If I play the game and it feels good, then I know it's good. But I don't never really understand the math behind certain choices in games. I'm not the numbers coach. I'm the gameplay coach. GG. I see you on the Swifty, yes sir. Swifty is the way to go. 
I'm still trying to balance when I should be playing Lethal Tempo, but... How mad is this guy, by the way? <laughs> I'd be so FK tilted if I was this Kragas, by the way. I, uh, let's see, I, I wouldn't come back after that. No, I'm kidding. You can't die, FK. I probably, probably won't come back, though. Like, if, after my ankles are destroyed like that, no. I'm not coming back. Alright, moving on. Yes, I go Fleet, Second Wind, and D-Shoot so I can match the sustain in the early lane. And then after level 6, this matchup just becomes super easy. Alright. Yeah, I spawned all the creatures. See, I I, I play the Gragas like that. Nobody says anything. Only kill 1v9 and Alan Timo are the homies there. And then I miss one cannon. And I spawn all the creatures. Minus one. Oh, sorry. Piggies. Turn out to be piggy challenge. You guys failed. OTP, you guys made me upset. Like my champs' abilities are just too slow. If you use them like that, I can see what you mean. I've never heard somebody say that his champions' abilities are too slow. That's why he can't win the lane. Kraken, you don't have Kraken. Oh, yeah, I guess they're too slow. They're actually too slow. I see what he means. Well, I guess we don't have to play against enemy comp because enemy comp is gonna be really hard for me in late game. If they were like, if this game was like being played out, I think it would be extremely hard for me to position against enemy comp. Yo, welcome everybody. I'm gonna try and outplay him. I think he's trying to do it himself though. He wants to eat me. <laughs> no, this is so sad. I'm so sorry, Gragas. Yeah, that's true, Alan Timo, but like, what top lane champion right now doesn't have sustain? Oh, I EOE the turret with E as well. The thing is, I think one of the most important thing of any laner right now has to be sustain. Jax, Jax plays with D-Shoot, Second Wind, Grasp, and Biscuits. How do you mean he has no sustain? Even Timo has sustain, yes. I think you should play... You probably play a lot with Fleet Timo, no? What's Gwen sustain? Gwen has Omnivamp. Not too much sustain early, though. What do I take this game? Well, we're pretty much full AD, right? So I should go AP anyways. Will you be doing Yumi Top 2 Master soon? Yeah, bro. 100%. Of course I will. I'm definitely going to play Yumi Top and queue up for that. Definitely will do that. Kluge. Okay, Riven plays with second wind and D shoot. Also has sustain now. True. But Riven can't really do damage when she plays with second wind D shoot in most matchups. Also, Riven needs to build damage and needs ability haste. And a champion like Jax can just rush Divine Sunderer and still one-shot everybody. Riffin can't. Right? So that's a big difference. So what's your counter to that, Parandigo? Your turn. Yeah, old early. We're dead as shit, though. Woo! Now there's, there's like million things! That's what I meant. They have like, it's like Ash ult, Ori ult, Gragas ult, Bart ult. Legit four ults I need to dodge. And then there's also Bart Q and Graves W. Yeah. Like, imagine I have to actually play against this comp. How can I play around... Bart ult, 
Ori ult, Gragas ult, and Ash ult, and then also great. Like they each have at least one ability that completely destroys me. I forgot that they had one more. I didn't like. I didn't. Oh shit! I, my camera. Whoops. I just dodged it. Oh my bad. I want to be here. Oh, I got to be here. Your turret is gone, bro. Who else is coming? Bart is over the wall. Yeah. I should play for bot tier 2 now. really playable I swear Ash hard counter skill like it's impossible to play against Ash's kill until I'm level 16 then level 6 I just watch with her but before level 16 Ash hard counters me it, am I am I right with this kill 1v9 like I, I can't play against Ash like I legit can't play against Ash yeah when you get 16 it's fine but then that, that, that counts for every champion in the game almost, right? But Ash, holy shit, her W and her ult, it's so hard to play against her. Yeah, if you don't have ghost. Okay, if you have ghost, fair. Bitch. Oriana death sound. Alright, Grog is gonna fight me again. Well played. They got me. <clears throat> I need some water quickly. Bit of it. We're getting Nash. I like that. Okay. I mean, game's kind of over because my team was doing amazing too. It's just been a weird game. But Lenny was really fun this game. Not for Gragas though. Dude, if you press, like, just, just like, ping like this every time on wards, like, here, 15 gold again. I think, on average, every game, I probably get, like, 60 gold, 50 gold. Easily just pinging wards every time. Probably even more some games. I, just right there, boom, plus 15 again. Just make it a habit. Every time you see wards, just G click. Plus 5 gold every time. Why not? Some APM practice too. Alright, get this fast. Get bot side I gotta get the wave first. No, I get the bot side camps first. I get level 16. Oh. I need something to proc fleet off. That's free money. Level 16! Let's go! Time to have some fun. Time to have some fun. I'm gonna keep pushing.
That's four people, a bit too much. Swiftness boots is so good against our comp, it's crazy. They all five have slows, annoying slows. Yeah, walk forward. Bait your team to walk into me. Okay, let's see what we can do here. I'm still yet to get a penta, so let's do that. Oh, that old kind of sucked. Oh, too far. I'm too dead. Okay, too bad, too bad, too bad, too bad. I lost camera control there too. Ah. Oh. Nice! Lovely. Alright, we're back. We're Barak. No, we're not Barak. Hello! Are we Barak? Okay, I think we're back. Quick Dutch internet, GG. 800 gold. Mm, mm, I'm gonna get red buff. This build looks so ugly. These are all super cheap items too. No? Actually, stone raids are pretty expensive. These two items are cheap. That build looks funny. Oh, I misclicked. We have double or triple in a she just end now. I like that. I like that. That was a Picasso play. We gotta, gotta got him there. Hold. Walking around. What are you gonna do? Where are you gonna go? Oh. My bad. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry for breathing. Sorry for breathing. <laughs> I wanna kill myself now. This was so fun. No. No. I'm sorry, bro. I kind of wanna try going this setup against Aatrox because Aatrox also is kind of a weak early game champion. Oh, uh, this. After first base, I might have a few struggles, but it's all gonna be about spacing. I will scale extremely well into this game. I also have a Janna and Oriana that give me movement speed, so it's really good here. A pretty free matchup here, so I can try and scale with. Uh, ghost in this uh, But what was I referring to? Um, I think Kale needs to really understand how to play with reset timers if you have if you have a good understanding of reset timers Which is arguably the hardest uh, You know fundamental to uh, to master um, Then I think your Kale's really good and that means setting up your own reset timers, but also canceling your opponent's reset timers especially in uh, games where um, You're playing counter matchups I like Fleet and Ghost versus him. Yeah, I think Fleet is good against this poke, right? But I'm playing Fleet almost every game. I wanted to try Lethal Tempo because I'm playing against the weakest early game janitor and against Aatrox. So I feel like I don't really get punished in the early game here. I already died with MMR, bro. We're, we're close to masses MMR. We're, we can uh, like finish the challenge very soon. Should I pick my OTP if I have a counter picked? 
Uh, good question. If you are an OTP, let's say you're a Riven OTP and they pick Poppy. I see something in the sky that which looks really weird. I know what it is. Um, let's see a Riven one trick, right? And you're playing against Poppy. Maybe that Poppy has only played the matchup twice before. If you played it 20 times before, it's fine. Where's your early ward? I'm not doing that against these champions. I'm kind of scared. And I'm also kind of brain FK. <laughs> yeah, bro, it's a UFO. Holy, holy, holy UFO. Passing by. Oh, not ironically. What the hell is that, though? It's flying back here again. It's flying really low. That's really weird. It's going really slow as well, but it's like extremely close to my window. Has to be like a drone. Okay, he's second wind and the shoot, so I shouldn't be looking to poke him. Oops. I'm gonna do a third wave crash in this matchup chat because it neutralizes the matchup. Which is good, so I want to neutralize this matchup because when I do a third wave crash, he's just gonna play out the bounce into me and then I play out the bounce into him and it's gonna be completely fine. I'm also pushing a little bit now. I'm not scared of it like a level 3 Shivana gank. If she comes, it's GG. I just have ghost to her ghost and I just run away. My crash is fine here. I can still hit the wave. It's kind of an awkward crash, but it's okay. Still hit the winners here. With two points of Q to just control the wave a little bit better here. I don't need my W. Want to ensure this crash? I could reset, but mm -hmm, should I reset? I don't think I should. I think I'm kind of fine staying. Maybe even contesting because my vehicle stops at two. I, I could make this push towards me, or I can contest right. I have a good, I have a good ward set up. My vehicle stops at two. I'm kind of safe. Shivera could look for a gank though. Right, Atrox is extremely weak early, that's why I'm just allowed to play like this. Very nice. Completely control the wave. We shot Javana there, 24. Ooh, a little bit of movement. Dude, I'm playing aggressive kill this lane. Now I can reset. Ah, what do I go? Just go Boots Dagger, it's all good. Cream snipe via drone, yeah, they have UAV on me. I gotta want to take my reset now, because if I don't take it now, actually, I could have continued laning. To be fair, the reason why I should have continued laning here is because Shivana, yeah, like I said, Shivana's bot side again. I should have continued laning. I was completely fine laning 1v1, and I could just slow push it to hard push again, but I'm not losing anything here for resetting, right? But I kind of give Aatrox a free crash here. That's my only, that's the only thing I dislike. If I get level 5, I can run him down here, maybe. Especially when you use skews like that. Lovely. Poor Marius. I got an instant recall. Ah, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, nah, 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 I should still get this. I guess it's W, by the way, it's still better. <clears throat> Alright, we just dismantled this Aatrox landing phase. <clears throat> yes, I'm XQ first every game. Balanced? You're saying Kale is unbalanced. I've got chat to say Kale is unbalanced. Yeah, Kale is unbalanced, bro. Yo, I wish I knew about fundamentals when I started playing League. Thank you so much for the sub, boss. Sorry that there's no notification. It's because my stream labels is not working. But thank you so much for the sub. Right, now we're level 6 for free.
I'm finally also happy that I can start playing range champions a little bit better. Never really played League of or League of Legends. Never really played range champions in my career in general. There's a plant in the river. I should hard push you by the way. I, I should have hard pushed this faster. The reason I need to is because this wave is coming. This guy doesn't even want to trade anymore, he's scared of me. I respect it. Goodbye, Cannondale. I'm not scared of Shivana Gangs, really. She's not level 6 yet. Gonna look to push this wave in and probably look for Scuttle. Or plant the river. So trading HP is fine for me. Now let's look for the plant. Oh, I shouldn't... There we go. Sadly the furthest away, but still fine. He might hard push this, so I gotta run. Right, so we traded HP as much as I could. <clears throat> knowing consciously that I had the priority and I could play for the plant in the river. So now he's half HP, I'm full HP again. And he just hates his lane. That's why he's pushing towards me right now. His lane is Jover. Any Jovers in chat? Any j j j j j Jovers? It looks like Kill is broken, champion, no chat? It's because I have four manus. It's because I have four manus. It all started with by looking for priority and doing a third wave crash. And then I spaced one, I traded well, because of course that is spacing, right? That is gonna be a little bit harder to replicate. And then on the bounce, I made I did slow push into hard push. I reset, I killed him on the bounce because of item lead. Then I pushed it into his uh, then I had to bounce towards him again. I played with the snack, and now I just, just can't play the lane anymore. I gotta play slow with my mana here. It's the only issue here. I ain't got mana. I gotta only play with E. Why are you still pushing to me? I got ghost again. I can ghost him down again. Kill him on the bounce. No, the bounce. Like your. I won't say. Every auto attack I do on him, he just hates me more and more. Shivana's bot. Hey, jokes. Goodbye, boss. You've been fundamentally dismantled. Bye. Kill. Actually, I pushed too much, my bad. All good. <laughs> I love this champion. I actually am an insane amount of fun playing this champion. A lot of people thought I wouldn't still be able to use all the fundamentals that I do on Riven. Again, on champions like Kill, for example, right? Because Kill has no wave clear and doesn't get priority. But you see how I'm still able to do it, even though I'm playing Kill. Barely any wave clear and barely any priority, yet I'm still doing it consistently every game. What else? Sorry. Oh. Trade one for one at least. Take it. He flashed, right? I didn't expect Shivana to show up there. She has a lot of farm, by the way.
Can you do fundamentals on Nessus? Yes, I can. I'll hit Master with Nessus too. This drone is still in the sky here. And it's making me severely uncomfortable. I don't know why there's just a drone here. Needed some quick thinking there in that scenario there with the Shivana just now, right? If I don't flash in the Aatrox, I just die probably. Like, if I flash away, the Shivana would just ult after me with Red Buff, right? So I have flashed on the... I flashed on the Aatrox to at least force him off for one. Are you doing Maul fight? Yes, sir. Maul fight going to be easy, though. Soon I'll do a tank pull. I'll do like a Sante, Maul fight, Mundo. Orn or something. No Cassante, I want to respect you. You know, I've never played a single Cassante game in my life, unironically, by the way. Not even kidding, I've never played Cassante yet. I want to play it. Alright, Chad, we're scaling this game, but my entire team is losing besides Viego, I guess. Please don't cancel me. This W range is crazy high, actually. Have you done Aatrox? I have. I have done Aatrox. It's on YouTube. And all the votes I've done are on Patreon. Alright, chat. Um, I'm the only weakness in this game right now, right? With, maybe with the VA go. Um, so, my biggest goal in games like these is to play... In a way where I'm not dying for things that are just pretty much not worth it. If I ever die, like, the the odds of me winning this game are gonna be really hard, right? But at the same time, I do want to try and look for at least some sort of risk because... Actually, no, I'm killed. I can play pretty chill here. As long as I still keep scaling through sideline, I'm gonna be fine in this game. My vehicle is gonna invade here, so I'm gonna use that time and take this quickly. Oh, no, I'm getting uh, The W was still there. I'm griefing. I missed one of my goals so hard. Wow, that's so unfair, actually. I should kill is broken. We're around Diamond 2, Diamond 1 MMR. I'm gonna have to focus on this game as well for myself, chat. I have to make really good decisions here. So I need 11.50. I know he has flash, this is Scuttle respawning. My Viego's bot side again. I'm gonna push this wave in first. I'm gonna make sure I don't die to the Shivana. I can kind of judge if Shivana's here or not, because if this Aatrox walks up, then Shivana's here, right? So if he's not walking up, I know Shivana's not here. Does that make sense? I probably want to go bot lane soon. I can gank mid here of the scuttle because I have tempo in top lane. I'm 
We have no engage though. Need to defend bot here too. We need to defend this. I need to I need to try and push this. I need to try and kill this guy. I need to go for risky plays. I need to take risk this game. Good. I need to go for any play. Like, what's the odds of me winning this game if I play normal? Holy, holy, holy! The odds of me winning this game without taking risks are maybe 10-20%. So any odds I can take that is above 20%, I will take. Okay. I need turret still. I have both some still. <clears throat> I'm gonna probably walk top here. Because entire enemy team is gonna go bot lane here. So I wanna try and get this tier 1 turret. Adrian is completely out of the game. Like, if he shows himself to me, I'll, I'm gonna run him down. If he steals this, he's legit the goat. Oh, unlucky. If I kill this guy one more time, it's crazy good. I gotta trade, I gotta trade the resources here. Did Orion just TP behind? She did. Why is my team forcing fights? Like my teammates are the one my teammates are the ones engaging instead of just farming. I don't know. You're crazy. Ah, I should have flushed. I had the time to flush. I had the time to flush. I, I thought I had like one second longer, but I didn't. I have 8 out of 10 kills. Hard game to play. No, no, no. Please don't have half. Thank you, whoever did it. Get the goat. Now you will realize that Kayla is not a solo carry champion. <laughs> There's not a single champion that can carry this game. That's like the worst argument I've ever heard in my life, boss. If there's any champion that could arguably maybe carry this game, it is Kale. What champion is going to carry this? Riven? No. Volibear. Yeah, Volibear would carry this game. Gluggy.
Nice. Good job, team. <clears throat> Jenna just flash ulted, right? What a mechanical genius. That's an engage, I guess. My Oriana is flanking again. That guy unironically just flash ulted. My teammates are creatures. Alright, we hit sweet 16. We need one pick right now. If I get one pick right now, we can fight the saw. Oh, I can't say the word kill, by the way. It's illegal. My bad, right, games. Thank you for the prime, boss. Came from YouTube. Good to see you, brother. Well, goodbye. Try to clear the wave at least so they can't end. They might still end. It's nice that my teammates are at least pushing out sideways, right? We're really pushing out sideways. We're buying tier, hextech alternator, and oblivion orb at once! Then like she's building like it's 0 and 5 and building three items at once. What are you actually doing? All of them, by the way. Like actual idiots, man. This is Diamond 2, Diamond 1 MR. You're itemizing like this. You are legit dumb. Please don't walk up. Just farm that at least. Holy shit, they killed somebody. Crazy. If I can get the skill. Okay, Varus actually got two shutdowns. Not bad. I can actually get mid tier 1, I think, here. Only Shifana's alive. Atrix is top. I'll kill him if he comes. I'll one shot Senna too. I can get this mid tier 1. I don't need, need to rep off. Yeah, Shifana's on there. I don't deal enough damage with the Shifana yet. She has too many resistances. I got the one can shut down. I think my team can survive. Would be amazing. Just don't die and then we're fine. Just don't die and we're fine with the with the with the trade that I did. I don't know. It's like I'm watching bolts play. It's actually like watching bolts play. Do I build Rylize? I mean, I can get the spike, right? I guess. Okay. Enemy team also doesn't know how to play macro, at least. Nobody blocks, of course not. Alright, we still have one Nexus turret. Aww. Uh, no blue. Well, back to base we go. Walking with my dick in my hands. I can't do shit, man. I got the 1k shot down, or I got the shot down there. I'm really tanking now, at least. Oh, they're gonna get Nash. I'm gonna push out both. You're gonna walk away here, and you're not gonna take my resources. Right, check my side those too. Amazing.
My kill is the lowest MR in the game, I actually didn't know that. Yeah, 42 is extremely low. I take... Hmm. I'm gonna flip the game here. Mm, he actually left. Bro, it's so hard to play. I have so many things to dodge, Perma. I'm full built. Oh. I'll have flash in this fight and I'll wrap buff. I need to try and one-shot somebody! <sighs> the problem with my comp as well is the only engage that we have is Varus ult. He needs to land it on the important targets. I have nobody to frontline for me. Like, I have nobody that can, like, take skill shots for me, you know? Like, I need somebody to, like, take Zerati and shit like that for me. Do I just don't bomba send it? Maybe it wasn't good. <laughs> okay. See, I th maybe, maybe I thought that was an angle. Oh. Nah. I lose the game like that. I can't do that. I don't know. I don't know. I let the intrusive thoughts win chat. Intrusive thoughts took took over. Intrusive thoughts won, my bad. Oops. I shouldn't do that, man. I don't know. I don't know why I did that. Sucks. Well, did my best. That that Aatrox one, crazy. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking there, by the way. That was not it. No, no, not this guy, please. I hate Udyr Top. If you know, you know. I hate Udyr Top. I can't lane against this. I don't know how. It's fine. Let's learn. We're here to learn. Uh, do I want Lethal Temple? I probably want Fleet. Yeah, not take health. Any tips on Riven versus Mordekaiser? Don't use your E2 gap close, and then you'll be fine. I'll go full crit this build, because they have four squishy champions, so I think I can go full crit. Stormraiser, Kraken, Infinity Edge against their team. Trust me, Stormraiser rush. Why should I not rush Kraken? See, I was thinking Kraken, no, 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 I, I agree with, I disagree with you. Henny, I'm gonna go Kraken into Wit's End, because I'm laning against this or this, and they deal AP damage. So I go crack and wit's end, infinity edge, bloodthirster. I remember why I hit the champion. 
I am census on Twitter. <laughs> I'm gonna just burn my E, proc him with face rush, or with fleet rather, and then we'll sustain, it's fine. Right, you always wanna hit fleet on your opponents. Yo, my last thing! Yo, my last thing, chat. Did you? Now we're fine. He actually used both potions. I'm gonna get level 4 here first. I'm gonna potion so I can play out this bounce. Because he might try and kill me. Three melees and one caster for level four. I win because level four. Bitch. Worth. Probably not worth, by the way, but hey, I'll take those. Take those, take those, take those, take those, potatoes. Probably not worth all, though. Probably not worth though. Just need to make a point there. Just need to make a point there. Hey, Lois. I watched a lot of your YouTube videos and short recently. They are great. I'm so glad you picked up my favorite champ, Kel. My man. Appreciate it, boss. Alright, we have TP still. Now we can pretty much scale to level 6 for free, because this wave is slow pushing towards me, and then on the bounce I'll get level 6, right? So, we scale to level 6 for free, so... I think I'm fine in the matchup now. I just need to make sure he still pushes into me, right? And we got tier 2 boots. Okay, this guy seems angry. Ward here to see if he wants to recall afterwards. Ah, I'm just scaling. I hate this champion with a passion. Yes, mighty Broly, I am Dutch, boss. I am Dutch. Okay, I can heal 40 flat now by hitting him with fleet. That's pretty solid. That's pretty good sustain. Okay, I lost half my HP. I just can't remember what from exactly. How did I lose half my HP? Right. Apparently I lost half my HP. Okay, now I don't have to play melee range anymore. Okay... Lost the cannon. I'm gonna walk backwards to kind of bait him. I want 1.3k. I want 1.3k so I can get. Noon quiver. Noon quiver will allow me to play this matchup ten times easier. I've got the piece still. She. Yo, Grace Blackhead, welcome, boss. All right. 
Let's recall here. We can TP back. Um, this guy is building everything and nothing. I don't know what he's building. Everything and nothing, I guess. Is he proxying? Okay. Oh, board here, and we're good. Mighty bro, thank you for Prime Boss, my fellow Dutchman. Thanks, Nave. Alright. He has no potions, so I want to trade with him as much as I can. That's the ability you really want to dodge, right? Because that was like his passive ult. That one deals the meanest damage. I'm gonna ult this wave here again, but I'm gonna drag it a little bit back to the middle here. I wanna hit my fleet on him, so I sustain more. Alright, that was wave will come close to me again, and I can farm for free, right? It's all wave management on the champion. That's the ult passive, so I wanna dodge that. Fleet 2. Lovely. Hold this me in two. Uh, go on to the main. Please, 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 please. Turn, turn, turn back! Piggy! Alright, I'm gonna hold this means. I'm gonna drag them to the center. Why do I have a shutdown when we're 6-4 behind? How do I have a shutdown? What? Ain't no way with two kills. Alright, I'm gonna have to set up a reset now sometime soon. Uther could be recalling right now. The only issue I have with this part of the lane is that I'm half HP and I have no way to reset. I don't have TP, right? So I'm gonna have to somehow push his wave into him to set up my own reset. So I'm trying to move as much as I can to get as many fleet blocks, right? So I can sustain and make this bounce easier. I'm gonna have to somehow set up a reset here. So that's the only thing I'm thinking about here. How do I get a good reset? Could be through two ways. By letting him push me in and then collecting the wave as fast as possible and recalling. Or by trying to push the wave back into him, but that's probably going to be a lot harder to achieve. I don't want to lose HP. So I could reset right now, realistically. Unless he hard pushes. Oh, he's going to hard push. That's right, but I'm hiding myself. He doesn't know that I've stayed. And I'm going to hit him for fleet. If he hadn't hard push, I would have recalled. Oh. If he hadn't hard push, I would have recalled, by the way. Okay. Not sure stop side. He's gonna proxy. That's okay for me. Because I'm gonna answer by clearing this next wave too fast. Too fast. Fast as well, I guess. And then I can reset. Although 1.7 is my Kraken, right? So maybe I actually want to stay. And also Udo is gonna come behind me now. Yeah. I guess I'm staying for 1.7. Alright. He wants to try and attack me now as well. Thank you so much, cool dude. He wants plates too, maybe. Um. The better, the faster I recall. I'm gonna lose a little bit short term. He might get one extra plate, but in long term it will be worth for me to recall here. This is the best reset I can get, and I'm gonna run back. Like I said, I might lose a little bit short term, but long term it's gonna work for me. I had to set up a reset for myself somehow. Thank you for the prime, cool dude. And we're just scaling, right? And now I'm going to go Wits End into Infinity Edge, probably. Yes, TP. <clears throat> I 
Where is he? He's gonna probably reset TP, but that's okay. I don't want to queue here. Actually, I will. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Okay, he's going to TP anyways. Does he have item? No, he does not yet. All right, we're in a good position now. And now I want to try and like. Keep wave priority. There's a red buff too that I could play for. Oops. I got stop blessing it. Last hits. Okay, now I'm angry. Losing two last hits like that is. Okay. We're still adding the XP and the gold, so that's fine. Level 11 soon. We got TP as well. I got level 11 here on this wave, and then we can play for red buff. Yo, Riven Soul, good to see you, boss. Would be nice if we get this dragon, but probably not. Alright, so blessing last hits. I can play for plate here. I think he recalled, so it's fine using some tempo because I can just. He's getting mythic, right? So I'm gonna base TP soon, anyways. I think he's bot. Now I got some wave clear. It's so, Udir bot, he is. Yeah, he went bot. That's all good. I mean, I have TP, but I want to play this two, second wave too. Are these camps up? Could be. I'm gonna play for them. get some more resources here so I will fix on dragon anyways I can always just base TP right so it doesn't matter how long I stay on the map I can always find my own tempo timer with TP okay Uda's pushing top I'm gonna recall TP uh, I said with set right so can we get these two components and I uh, base TP top here I want this. <clears throat> Sucks. <clears throat> More tests per minute, so that's good. We just keep scaling. <laughs> I want to go bot soon. I'm gonna say me bolt. I gotta reset quickly. Annoying as champion. Support is so insane melee range because he can fear me. I mean, Syndra can't be here. Ezra ults, maybe the only thing that could kill me. Oh, Zyra's here, I guess. What? Smart studio, man. 
I need 1.4, but it's fine. The first I reset, the first I can be here to collect this. So it's okay to lose some tempo here. Alright, we're scaling, takes this minute. Level 13. It takes a time, it takes a while in the champion to get stolen, right? But I will play for this next as well. Like, just take some time. I don't have flash, but she doesn't have too much damage with her items. The second she missed EQ like that, I don't know if she had flesh or not. If she had flesh, we trade it. If she doesn't have flesh, I kill her. And now this gives me tempo to play for this, unless Udyr runs you really fast. So Udyr could go on top here, could go mid, could go bolt. Let's see. If he goes top, I get bolt tier 1. If he doesn't show, then I think I should recall. Alright, he's not showing top right, so I should recall here. Nocturne is coming bolt. Oh, he actually is top side. I mean, I don't think Nocturne is old yet, right? So then I can play for this. Also, Fleet... How's we sustain on the turret? Look, fleet gives me a lot of sustain on turret. Gotta keep moving here. Where are fleet procs? There, there he is. Ah, he actually does kill me. Thought I could maybe survive. Hmm. That's a fat shot down to him. Okay, that's greedy. I thought I'd have enough. Hmm. Nicht gut. Pretty squishy here, so I think I'm just gonna go for the uh, Infinity Edge now, by the way, chat. Let's go for this. Yo, Smoke, I'm doing th good, thank you for asking. Wow, that was point-click, boss. Or point-blank, rather. Alright, let's keep scaling. We're full item up on the Udir, so in that regard, we're very good. The side wave is pushing towards us, so we can collect this later. I'm just gonna collect top lane first, and then we can collect bot lane later. You're right, I can't outrun you, but I can out DPS you. Bot is pushing towards us. I'm just gonna try and get maximum EXP income for myself here. Is bot still pushing towards us? No, it's not. They're all 1 HP here. Okay, fourth and a half. No, I usually don't stream on Saturday, but I'm probably gonna start streaming again on Saturday. Okay. Not sure it's really strong. I'm gonna TP bolt here to get tempo, and I can push out both ways. I can push out this wave and next wave, and then that will also ensure that this bolt wave will push us push back into us. So here, I'm preparing the dragon by getting priority in this bolt wave, right? But I'm also gonna ensure that this bolt wave will push back into us afterwards. So this is just economically really, really beneficial for us. So now the side wave will push back into us. I'm level 15 now, right? So even though I'm playing for this dragon here with my team, I'm trying to maximize my own gold income as well in the meantime. This guy's pushing here. I'm gonna bot lighting again. Somebody has to go top. Vex has to pee soon. But Uther can't really push turrets with this build, right? So it's fine. One more level, chat. One more level. Oh, they're on Nash. I mean, I'm already too late. Even if I run, I have don't TP. I hope my team can 50-50 it. I just gotta play for this. Nice, they're off. Right, so there, there's two things I can do that. I can move to my team, but I instantly recognize for myself, regardless if I move or not, I'm already too late. I'm already too late. So it's better for me to just stay this and go for the 100% play. And now my team is under full pressure. Chaos pushing balls! Chaos pushing! Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gone. I need like a level 16. Oh, mama. I'm gonna get chased. I mean, I could sell, sell it and I have it. Alright. 
Alright, GG. I'm level 16 now. Now the game's over, bros. Now we've gotten our natural resource from the side lane. Now group and win a gang. Time to group. Time to group and win a game, bros. Time to group and win a game. Always 9 and 3? Won't matter. Won't matter. No. I got flesh. I'm 5 levels up on this guy that's 10 kills, by the way. What? That reaches? Sit down, bitch. What is Zyra's range? Alright, we need to sustain with Rep of him fleet. I lost flesh there. Not sure if worth. I'm gonna one shot everybody soon, by the way, with the script build. Also, E will one shot every. Oh, we can play for this. I'm gonna sustain with fleet here again. And the Rep buff. Uh oh. That's mid. I was dead. Oh, it actually is on me. That's really, really, really bad. I thought it was just mid. Ah, I'm griefing. Ah, that is not good. Gar not good. Shit decision by me to actually show to the wave. Uh, I'm thinking of going this. Have you ever been to Germany? I lived there for two and a half years when I was in SK. So yes, I have. If I get this, I pretty much have Sarajas. Okay, that's not true, but I get close. Especially if I get like one or two kills. Somebody has to defend both. We're still extremely strong here, right? I'm, I'm working towards my fifth. Everybody, like, this guy has 12 kills, but he's not that strong. I'm 100 CS up and I got like all the turrets, right? So it's only three items. I'm getting my fifth soon. Like, all my items are really expensive. <laughs> my damage is actually crazy. Mm, he does have this. I want to see to turret. Only S rule is gonna be harder for me to kill. Might need Lord Doms again. No, so I just will be fine. Oh. You wanna fight me, bitch? You have no idea what you're walking into. <laughs> Nocturne was like, wrong neighborhood! Udyr was like, oh, we can, we can deal with this guy. Nocturne knew it was coming. Yo, Ronin. Let's see, boss. He had a pink ward. Oh, no, that's awkward. I can watch the Zyra. Oh. Ah, oh, where did I flash then? Oh, <laughs> my bad. Shiny came for the prime. I may have just flashed against the wall. It's like, um. Yeah. Now it happens. Got the system's out though. Right, we're full build. Definitely gotta be more mindful of my throat. My bad. Exclamation mark wallop, alright, Jitasso. Jitas, nah. No. Jitasso, go think about it. Go think about it, Jitasso. No, go think about that one. I give you 10. Alright, Revenso, you as well. Think about it. Now you can think about it there. You can think about it. Okay, chat. Let's focus now. Alright, we're full build. Give me 30 min from last timers too. <laughs> Val, we just gives, gives bits for me to ban him. Okay. My bad. I forgot. There you go. Cool down for you too. Salute. Uh, okay, let me focus. Okay, now I gotta focus, okay? Like... How do I have 340 CS this game? From what? 
What are you? I can one shot this dragon nonetheless. I don't have flesh, why don't I have flesh? Gotta push forward. Goodbye! Dude, my champ is so disgusting, by the way. Like, the range plus the slow? Like, how do you play against me when I have this range and I slow you? AoE slow. Damaging abilities, so all my alt attacks, right? Like, the full alt attack slows them. Not only the alt attack that I land, it's so crazy. All me? I'm so good. Uh, no, no, man. Goodbye. That was interactive. What do you guys think of that? Okay, that was better. That was a better game than the last game. Okay, chat, we're gonna do mid lane fundamentals. Mid lane fundamentals coming in. Oh, it's Swain mid. I thought it was Tali Talia. Oh, yo, yo, I thought it was Talia mid. Swain is tricky. Swain is a lot harder. I would need second win in this matchup, to be Anybody honest. My Asura, thank you for the two months. Hi for all the educational conant. Uh, I should take second win against Swain because he's a really oppressive laner, but it's okay. We're just gonna be sustaining. He has goals, I have TP, so I can use that at least. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, chat. My runes are really, really wrong here. I should have fleet and I should have um, second wind. I have lethal tempo and no second wind. I'm, I have zero sustain. I'm gonna get destroyed in lane. My, my runes are really, really wrong. I was doing songs, I was. Okay, let's focus. Uh, this is just going to keep happening, by the way. I shouldn't trade HP. Yeah, I have no sustain, so I can't really play aggressive. No fleet, no second wind. She's doing level 3 top gank. Ah! I'm gonna use my E on this one. He's perfect CS. He's 19 out of 19. Well done by this one. Don't just W at least. Wow, it's casting on his melee. I'm gonna get level 4 here by one melee and one caster. He gets level 4 by one caster here too. He's running out of mana though. He's dead. The Jarvan places have decent. Oh. Oh, good attempt. He got his flash and ghost at least. It's okay. Talia has to go both sides. I'm gonna slow push this wave and hard push next, and then the Swain is stuck in lane chat. If I slow push this and hard push next, the Swain can now play out the bounce. Alright, I'm waiting for this wave to walk through lane, and now hard push there. Talia shouldn't be able to gank me because she's to play her both side camps. And then this guy's gonna be stuck in lane. Wow, that was really good by him. That's fine, he has no mana. Wow, Talia's top side? What did I see there? Was I just a bird? Am I bugging? I'm gonna wait for level 5 and then use my Q. Okay. And now he's stuck in lane chat, he can't hold this. I'm gonna base and TP back and the wave will bounce into me. 
So now he's gonna collect this wave, right? But you see, this wave is like stuck, and this wave is walking. This means the wave will bounce back into me. I think I just buy tier two boots now. Yeah, do. And now Swain cannot push out this wave, and it even walks into the turret. And as a result of this, I'm gonna be able to get a freeze. And now we do some mid lane fundamentals. I'm gonna ward right here. As Mad Bozo. He wants to recall, I gotta cancel his base. He gets level he gets 6 from these minions, by the way. Aloise. Ah. Uh, that guy is good. Dexy, thank you for the prime. Or oh, tier 2! What do I mean, prime? Thank you for the tier 2! That's why we have this ward. We're gonna drag these minions back to the center. By canceling his wave base once. I mean, it sucks that Talia is here to help him with everything. No way Talia pushes a full cannon wave. But still, Swain loses a full cannon wave here, right? And that is because I slow pushed into hard pushed previously. There you go, chat. Mid lane fundamentals. You see? The fundamentals that I use in top lane are still all applicable to mid lane. Keep that in mind. Thank you so much, Dexy, for the tier 2, man. So we're a little bit ahead in the XP, he just did level 6. Top lane struggling. He did get level 3 gank though. That was pretty clean. Oh, shut up with your Dutch ads. KFC. Let's play this. KFC ads. Did you? She got a blocker. Yeah, I'm gonna buy you Twitch Prime or YouTube Prime. I want to turn on the music though. That playlist is a bit better at the moment. GG. Okay. Oh, of course I get hit. He's getting ganked so often. Poor Swain. Jarvan doesn't have ult. Tried to last hit it, but it's good for the queen gets it too. Okay, nice. Sorry, I was a little bit AFK. Alright, let's get some plates. <clears throat> yeah. Guys, I'm gonna stop AFKing. My bad. I had to ult up a few times. Thank you for the 50, bro. I have magic resist, bro. Kel just has extremely low magic resist. I'm literally running magic resistant runes. Get him, cannon! Oh. Flash ult. Nice. Lovely. Did he flash? Did he flash on me? No, I just ghosted.
Actually, I think I should buy this. I think this is better. The honor damage is really nice too. <laughs> the Queen gameplay is working. She was 0 and 3, round mid, and now round bolt, and she's 3 and 3 again. Crazy. Nice. I'm base DP soon. I got Kraken. Talia, stop! <laughs> look at the, look at the Avengers. <laughs> Imagine being a mid lane main. I got the Avengers on both sides. This guy has no idea what's happening. <laughs> the Avengers. No! You only have Killjim. Back off. I gotta play really slow here. Lucian Nam is really strong, right? They can one shot me. Oh, what a crit. And the Kraken. And the Swain's completely out of the game. They got ganked so often, though. Can maybe roam here for the Quinn. No, I should be. There, there are four people both. I should play for this top tier one. Or. Mid tier one rather. Alright, enough ads. I've had enough. Can I get it? I'll get it soon. That actually hits him, crazy. She gotta dodge his E so he doesn't sustain also. Psst. Ah, it's GG. Kinda feel bad for the Swain, he got camped really hard, but yeah. I mean, he also just got fundamentally gapped. Million four males. <sighs> Focus on your four males, shit. They still apply to mid lane. They still apply to top lane. They still apply on kill. They still apply when you have no wave clear. Such a happy word. I 
I think we're getting really close to full master lobbies, by the way, chat. There's like three master players in this game. Uh, Ezreal recall. I'm going to go bolt. You can recall. The reason I want to be bolt so that I can progress for the bot tier one anyways, right? I'm going to Q this so I can AOE all the, all the minions. I'm not necessarily looking to progress too fast right now because I have... A lot of gold on base, and I don't want to lose my shotgun, right? So, how much do I need? Two more nine. Let's talk my lethal tempo here. But this is the type of beat I want. Talia could be here. I hit the turret like four times. Holy shit, I suck at this game, actually. That's eye-opening. Yeah. Oh, by the way, we're full AD. I need to go AP. Drown in the holy fire! <laughs> Base first, oh, goodbye. Ah, yeah, both sums. Should use them. Cool dance. Now, chat, I have my attack uh, champions only here. Right, I shouldn't do attack champions only now. Alright, let's just let's just let's just expand our lead, okay? We've already died. We have no more shutdown. We have nothing to lose. Maybe I'm even scarier when I have nothing to lose. He's gotten my shotgun now, now what? Now he can't get my shotgun anymore. So I'm not scared anymore. I'm scared. Oh, that's birds. Man, I think it's Talia, but it's this bird that he spawns on the map. It's so distracting. I think Talia spawns there, but it's a, it's a bird. It's a random bird in my lane. Another random bird in my lane, okay. Yee <laughs> Swain! Bird fight. Oh, come on. Goodbye. That E lasted is like a spit in his face, you know? I'm gonna recall and go here. I'm, I'm, I'm so greedy, Quinn. Please go, Bolt. Please. Oh, Quinn. Quinn, you're the goat. He knows he's the goat. He might know it. I've got to pee. I want to try and pressure this turret. And if my teammates die, then I'm never even going to move. This side is pushing towards us as well. I can push up top all the way. Get it to tier 1 for sure. Maybe even pressure tier 2. And if nobody catches bolt, I'll do that too. I don't mind getting extra farm. I kill turret and kill him after. Fight me then. When I kill the mean here, the hits get hits too. Not sure about this fight, I'll be honest. But I have a play with Bart and Jarvin should be fine. Mm. I'm gonna base TP. I have tempo. This way is pushing away from us, so it's good that I TP on it too. To fix it. I'm gonna TP here. We're getting close to level 16 chat. A ward here. 
I mean, I don't think I can win one the jacks without ult, but let's see. I actually get enough tempo for the turret. I see a golem camp behind me too. Nice. This is really massive. Jax walked away, so I guess nobody else is here. Quinn is hovering. If she hovers, I'm fine to walk up. She's not hovering. Ezra might run top. Okay, he's not. Now, there's three camps here I can play for. I just need to get the level 16 ASCP, right? And my third item. So, whilst the side wave is, Like, I crashed the side wave into the tier 2. Jax is collecting. Whilst Jax is collecting, I'm gonna take three jungle camps as well, because why not? Their blue is spawning too. But I'm not gonna go that deep right now, I think. I mean, they could be doing Nash, I guess. They're not doing it. Stupid. They should be doing Nash with two people dead. We can never contest it if they do it. Alright, whilst the sideways is pushing back towards me, I'm just taking all the drone camps. Talia two items, that's scary. Jax is no flash, right? So, I can't move one him for sure. Alright, we got item now. We're on the way to 16. 30% done. 30% of the job's done! We want Nash's next. I'm definitely claiming this rep off. It's my birthright. Okay, nice. I don't have TP on the map right now, so that's pretty scary. I am three items now. And on the way to 16. I think I can even try and... Okay, he gets slowed at least. The E on landing on him is still good because he doesn't get home guard. I got Rift Maker proc. I think Talia took all of this, but I get some boards by Bart. He's gonna have Spear Sojourn. Talia can always ult to me, which I gotta be careful for. Close to 16, but I gotta be scared of Talia ult here. And I have a fetch shutdown. Now, crashing into tier 2 again. Swain is here. Can... Okay, scuttle soon. Ward can give me XP. Freddy, this is uh, Diamond 1 slash Mastery Lobos. Solution is very strong with the Dami. They're not... They're, I think they're trying to set a trap up for me in side lane. I think Nami warded here. I'm definitely on the ward. It's nice that I have a Jarvan. I can kind of just take his camps. I just claim them. Okay, now one bot wave. I'm gonna have TP as well. Alright, chat, we got it. Level 16. Oh, why does Bard die just before the fight? That kind of sucks. Enemy team is doing dragon, right? That's why I'm paying to go Nash. I have extremely fast Nash with level 16 kill. It's just a really good call. Macro. Macro, bros. They do have three dragons, though. I'm not gonna push this. Wow, that prediction. Who else is here? They're all coming. And I got knocked up too. <laughs> I still just swipe him. He was playing it so well. Waiting for my ult to go away. Still got out of my range. Still one shot him. But I died too, which is kind of bad for the Nash push here. It's kind of crazy that I still kill him though. Alright, 
This game is still really tricky to carry. Not many people are making mistakes. Like, the Jack is never playing too aggressive. People are just looking to scale well. But it also kind of has allowed me to scale pretty well. Why is Nash better than Third Dragon? Well, it is. Just in terms of resources, right? And also, uh, my Bard was dead, so we couldn't look for a 5v5 there. So it was better to look to, to, to trade something, right? Silo is pushing away from us. That kind of sucks. Lucian is 3 items. What? No harder mechanic in the game than hitting the attack stack portal, I guess. Still want to play for the top tier 2 if I can. If I get this, I pretty much have Rabadons, right? I need 1042. We're hitting 3 waves at once. I need my team to pressure. Talia's coming. Oh my days. Wow. That kills me so fast. But why can't I just send four top every time, man? I guess because I'm not respecting it. That guy's gonna flush. Ah, they send four top every time. Their macro so annoying. Ah. I died so fast there. The Lucian ult and Nami. Flash. There's so many things to dodge. I shouldn't have flashed. I need my flash for this next soul fight to be fair. Me flashing is really really bad. Shouldn't have flashed. Not worth it. I wish I bought. I need Rylai's last, I think. I hope Bart, oh, but Swain has no TP by the way, they can't contest this. It's good, we have tempo everywhere. We have Bard ult and Jarvan ult with it for the Talia without flash. That guy should die. Quinn is bot though. I gotta push the sideways back. I mean, now it's all mechanics, right? Kind of. Whoever wins the team fight just just wins. The 
flag. She can't get a pet. If you play against a jungler without dashes, they pretty much can steal this. Right? That's why we do it here. It's not a 50-50 because Talia doesn't have flash. So she can't flash over the wall. If you play against again against junglers without without the dashes and they have no flash, they pretty much always can't contest. My team is fight. Okay, they kill. Nice, I play for this. That's what give me my red eyes to them. I got two really great Nasher calls this game. Yes, I will do GP. Leonard Bart. I should E faster. Whew. Good spacing by me there. Good. I did 369 damage now, I saw it. Well, we basically got everything, but I don't have mana. The Baron Gold's really won this game. Oh. I'm just gonna be cringe. Low. GG. Oh, that was a hard game for sure. Enemy team played it really well. They barely made mistakes. Jarvan or Lucian only had three deaths, Jax only had or Lucian only had four, Jax only had like three. So it was really hard. Oh chat, we're full masters. We're against full masters. This is the last kill game. Let's go. Now, this guy is a viewer, so he knows about my early game tricks. I'm just not too scared of Zed level one. Right, they have Zed Evelyn, so I can just walk like this. I'm gonna walk all the way around. He could have been here or here right now, so I'm gonna walk all the way around. Looking for priority. Ajax will be leashing. This guy's playing Flesh Ignite, so it's a little bit more aggressive. Probably want to do a third wave crash. Evelyn's passing to top, I believe. So third wave crash is solid, it will neutralize the lane. Yeah, there's Evelyn. Oh, yeah, she's passing to top, right? She's three... She's 12 CS. And a blue buff, so she's passing top. I gotta make sure to crash this ASCP. I need to not focus on Aatrox, I just need this wave to be in. And put two points in Q so I get more AoE on the wave here. Get 19 out of 19 too. Okay, my Talon wants to invade. I gotta flash that. Flash that. He's losing fate means here though. Kid me! Ah. Uh, I didn't have my W. I'm definitely a pig. I thought I had W, then I would just walk out! I'm a pig! <laughs> All I had to do was just reset. My bite. There was no way I could die there. That's the only way I die. 
Bye bye. Wunder, 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 mir gut. It's a really bad death though. Forgot I had two points on my Q. I don't want to continue this play. I need, like, I'm losing CS here. Actually, it's a freeze. Ooh, it's a freeze. If my means aggro on the right means, that is. It's not a freeze. It's a slow bounce. He's still mid. He gets a kill. Oi, 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 oi. That is not good, chat. It's fine. He's coming back to top. He's not gonna reset yet. What a giga chat. This guy does not care. He wants my ass. He's level 5 already as well because he got mid EXP and CS. So even though he moved away and lost a lot of means, it actually doesn't matter. I'm not in a good position. I better just recall because if I don't know, I will never get it. Yo, boss, how about the challenge? Under two deaths and I give another five subs. Oh my days. How am I gonna go under two deaths this game, bro? Against Evelyn Aatrox when he's already two and zero. I'll take the challenge, though. Under two deaths this game? Wait, that means I can't die anymore. Under I cannot die anymore. I thought I had one death at least. Okay, zero deaths the rest of this game and I get five subs. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what I can do. I get 5-2 if under 2 Ah, but... Too much pressure! Alright. So what if I just AFK right now? Then you guys just lose, by the way. You guys didn't sign the terms and agreements. It's <laughs> plus 5-2, that's I get plus 5-2. Nah, well, I had, so then I win anyways. I'm gonna make this way push towards me. Thank you, Th Teos Rama. I appreciate that, bros. Where's 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 Scarlet set or Atrox? Where's he at? Did he like DC? Oh, there he is. Oh no. Oh yes! Now he's mad though. Now he's mad though. I gotta be careful. Like he's angry. He's seething with rage. So I gotta be really careful now. I'll give you a million sub if you have zero deaths this game. I at least have made the wave push back towards me, so I'm able to farm here for free. I need him to e Q me and the means here, so that the wave pushes back into me like that. Right, if he Qs the means, the wave pushes into me, which is really nice for me. Why is Evelyn randomly strong and two and two? I'm never gonna die. Or I'm never gonna live to her. We have card is old, I guess. Oh, 
<laughs> that shot is playable. See chat, I want to stay. I want to stay, I don't want to recall. I kind of need to kill this guy, no? I'm gonna die. He leveled up. Nah, he's so lucky, by the way. Okay, never mind. He's an Aloys Watcher. He calculated that. Happens. My stand subs, GG. Oh, if I get to be on the cannon, I'm happy. Wait, true. Evelyn died early on Krugs. She's 4-2-2 two and two and cards is 0 zero one. When Evelyn died early on Krugs and they're like even CS. I'm still ahead in top lane. Uh-oh. Oh, Swifties. Hey for my kebab. Yo, Spring SC2, gold for 10 years, and now platinum 2, 60% win rate. Salute, boss. I need to adjust the positive gaming position. Evelyn is bot. Oh, it's doomed. It's Joe over chat. Oh, we're fine. Ah oh, yes, exhaust too. Money, money. Change, song, or Th riot, holy. Thank you for the three. Might have to keep the song on though. Because I didn't get the shutdown. Chat, should we switch the song, yes or no? Switch the song, yes or no? Keep song, holy. <laughs> We keep the song. Goodbye, Majestex. We keep the song. We keep the song. No, we keep the song. We can win, chat. We're in the comeback position. <laughs> Report, Majestex. He's so shit. Nah, you just don't have fundamentals. Fuck off. <laughs> Make a Giga Chat face for the rest of the Gamer Chain song. How do I do a Giga Chat face? I can do it. Okay, I'll change the song, I'll change the song, GG, you won. <laughs> da -da -la -la -la. Beefy, we had enough of Tame Impala. La la la. <gasps> la la la.
You think I'm walking away from this wave? You bet your ass I am. <laughs> Worth. Hello, is five subs here. Do you promise? I need one more death, right? No. You can leave. No kidding, chat. Please stay. I don't want to be lonely. Woo! Where are we? And now we're 60 is up. Was I was the Aatrox was two and zero, right? Yeah, he was. And now we somehow got first turret and 60 CS up up. I know what you're doing. Yeah. I'm probably dead, yeah. I go to the stream, yeah. Na, 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 na. I didn't want Evelyn to get it. Shy. Shy! She. Shaggy FPS. That sounds good, boss. Okay, my bad. Alright, let's focus on Rear Not. I've kind of been griefing. Not gonna lie, this death is really, really bad. Really, 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 like really, really bad. I should just be playing for Herald, not pushing this shit out. The risk to reward is not worth it, but I'm kind of griefing there. Oh, get that Cherry Long guy. Cheng Long. How is he alive? Oh, he's not. Oh, my team's surfing it here. Sheesh. Ooh, the exhaust. Yeah, I lost my shotgun and the food turret here, but I can probably get Herald still. It's okay. My bad, though. Six shot. Good to see you, boss. Yo, Rako. Please go for this wave. Oh, you're dead anyways. Right? Oh, he's the luckiest person in the world. Alright, let's push this out. Let's get Harold. This will give me 200 tokens, and with those 200 tokens, I can buy a knight with your... No, I can get the tier 2 turret. Alright, let's go. Get this neutral objective from the map. Oh. I could, almost couldn't resist the urge. I hope this guy ults. He did ult. Well, GG. I need Evelyn to like ult. Okay, he got me good. He got me good there, I'll be honest. My bad. Two deaths in a row now on side lane. Gar nicht gut. Sehr schlecht, my bad. Types like this, Kalista. Ah, uh, it's a dark steel angle. I'm kidding, it's a pink ward angle. Let's focus, chat. I still got this Herald. I'm probably gonna use a mid. I got the P in 30. I'm still 10 cents per minute, even though I have four devs. It's kind of crazy. I just always gotta be extremely careful playing sideline this game. Because of, I mean, they're top side, right? Uh, nothing new for me. Just how life goes sometimes. Uh... Why no game audio? There is game audio, but I'll put it louder. Everyone's dead, so this is my time. My time to shine. I won't get another opportunity like this. How am I still two levels up? I don't get it. I died like twice. So my champion is that broken.
Yeah, it is broken. Evelyn is coming. Evelyn's coming for a red buff. <laughs> I smell it. But she could be buffing like this right now. Ooh, now you're dead. That was my kill, bro. My movement there was too too clean. He didn't expect it. He didn't expect me to go forward. I mean, I could also play for this, I guess. Next patch, this will actually give me money, right? Not the tier one or tier three, but the, the inhib will give me 400 gold. Did he just E forward? Bye, bitch. Team got this. I need 3.2. This gives me 300 gold, so I need like Krugs in a wave. Or I could have just sold D Blade. True. Probably going to have to, anyways. Alright, I'm gonna go bolt. Worth. I need level 16 chat. Anything for that. Why do I do Baron so fast? Because I have two only Titans boss. They will break against my Heal by fire. She doesn't have ult yet, by the way. Oh! Range is so crazy, bro. I'm sorry, Win Win. Win Win. Win Win. You're your best boss. Go end, please, with your fundamentals. <laughs> GG, boss. <laughs> He's really mad. GG.